Yo! Okay. Should we let the song finish? I'll let the song finish. Which kind of soon is it? Now! It's that kind of soon. Took me two minutes. That is Eureka's map in the thumbnail. Yes, I'm playing. I'm playing Eureka's map. But finally, after like five months, <laughs> they sent it to me, and they're like, "Can you please play this?" Canadian, this better be good. It's, uh, yeah, it better be good. I'm told it took them seven months to make the map. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Song is officially over and therefore stream is in session. <laughs> Guys, look, this is crazy. Okay, one second. Hi, but also bye. Okay, guys. I don't know if you know who what's the name of the person? Let me check. Oh, what's their name? There's this person in my Discord server. In the escape room submission channel, which by the way is still open. You can still send things to it. Olegsha. I don't know how you spell or how you pronounce that. Olegsha. They built, they set up this entire, I did not tell them anything. They just built this entire website with a list of every single submission that has been sent there. All organized. It tells you what um, kind of version of Minecraft, what just version, when it was released, where you can get the download, some extra notes, and, and everyone who is credited. And, and even the names, if applicable. This is insane. Like, I... <laughs> they just, they just, like, like a month or two ago, they just showed me this. Like, hey, I just finished, I just finished more, okay. Cringe bot. Beat my time, I got 10.13? What do you mean? Okay, well, I guess it's not that long if you got a 10.13. But I'm not gonna get it first try. 
Um, deadline in two weeks. I said two weeks or more, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, anyway, anyway. Um, yeah, yeah, so, guys, here's the thing. Um, also, it's, like, completely up to date, for one. Uh, so, I, I, I checked earlier, because I wanted to see how many of each version there are. Uh, of the total, let's just do capital E. There are, no, okay, that doesn't work, that doesn't work. Yeah, so of the Java Edition ones, there's 81 Java Edition maps. Of those, actually, there's only 79, because uh, I think there's JE. 79, that's what I meant. 79 Java Edition maps. Of those, one of them, one singular one, is in 1.8 by this guy. Another one is in 1.12. Only one in 1.12. I don't know if I'm even going to play these, but they exist. But, uh, you know, with with 80, with 79 maps to play, I mean... Anyway, there's also one in 1.16. Uh, 11 in 1.17. 10 in 1.18. And 55. 55 maps in 1.19, which obviously makes sense. It's the latest version. But... Still, even if I ignore all the old ones, like the older versions, that's 50 maps to download. Which means I'm probably not going to do most of them. And I haven't downloaded any of them except for Placeholder, which was the first one. It was a map that already existed. It's, I've been told it's not really an escape room as much as it is just an adventure map, but it's kind of like a puzzle map. I don't know what kind of puzzles that is. Like, I don't know what that means. I don't know what puzzle map means in this case but they say it's applicable they say it fulfills like the requirements so we'll see i people who played it you can tell me more <laughs> but I, yeah i've already got it downloaded there's actual speedrun maps for placeholder speedrun maps for placeholder strats that's what you mean all right sorry it's 2 a.m yes it is it is absolutely 2 a.m in europe Sorry. Okay. Okay. So, this is the only one we're going to play. I don't want to play, act like, the actual... I feel like... I'll be honest. This escape room probably isn't going to show up on, on the video. Because I don't think it's really an escape room, whatever it is. It seems like it's just an adventure map. Kind of. I don't know. But that's why I want to stream it. Because I feel like it's good. But it's definitely not going to be in the video. Hence, we're here. As for the rest of these, I'm probably not going to play these on stream. Because most of them are probably broken, I've been told. But, like, I've asked people to play through these and find ones that work. And 90% of the time, they say, this map is broken, this map is broken, this map is broken. Um, which might be them just not being able to find things. But, yeah. This one, at least I have confidence in, because it's, like, a proper, like, formal map. So... Let's hope it doesn't take me 50 years, which it won't, because I'm the smartest Minecraft player of all time. It's a really good map. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, it has a texture pack. Uh, I'm on 1.19.2, this should be fine. Okay. Okay. Oh, I still have F3 Beyond. Right. So... Hmm, I know this is the lobby, but as an exploiter of things, I like to try and exploit. Okay, right. Yeah, of course. So we're an adventure already. That's out of the norm. But again, it, this feels like it is intended to be an adventure map. It's just test audio. Okay. Okay. Hmm. But I can flip trap doors. I know this is the lobby. I just want to. Yeah. So. Let's probably wait like a couple more minutes. I made it to stream. Yes, you did. Rec Rap is the smartest player of all time. Okay. I'm just, I'm just asking politely. Are you joking? Are you joking? Like, is that a joke or are you serious? I'm just, I'm just I'm like, I'm not making any statements. I'm just 
I just want to know if you're joking when you say Rat Crap is the smartest. I'm just, like, I'm not making any. Okay, anyway. Is there something hidden in here? There's n there's a thousand percent chance there's something hidden. There is something hidden. Trapped? No? Wait, oh, there's... A ladder? Block of quartz. You can't even place this. This is smooth quartz. You don't even need a ladder. You can... <laughs> okay. And the ladder's gone! What? Okay, this is already kind of suspicious. That's kind of strange. Um, okay. <laughs> there has to be something. Oh, they're all locked. What? Wait. Is he... Okay. Uh... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I bet you could do this jump. I'm so sure you could do this. <gasps> yeah, you can. <laughs> Wait. Is this intentional? Wait. There's a carve out in the wall. Wait. This has to lead some. Oh my gosh. No, hang on. I'm hellbent on this. That's intentional. That was way too convenient to exist. This leads somewhere. <gasps> okay. I'm too good. I'm too good. I overdid it. That's how skilled I am. What? Like the moment. Okay. The moment I saw this, which basically just this is this is like practically saying it's trying to give you headspace to do the jump. I'm gonna be so mad if this leads nowhere, but it looks like it's supposed to lead somewhere. Okay. Well, now I'm, uh, now I fell off. What? I hit D instead of S. Okay. I'm not start. I'm not playing this map until I get here. That goes somewhere. That goes somewhere. I promise you, it goes somewhere. I'm holding shift. Oh, shoot. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You saw I did it like fourth try last time. I'm just... I'm warming up. Okay, that doesn't break anything. Wait, this breaks though. <laughs> L, broke your map already. Took me 10 minutes. Okay. <laughs> I, I'm that, I'm, I'm too good. I'm too good for the jump. The jump is not at my skill level. I'm beyond it. That's the only reason. <laughs> I'm so good at the jump, I can't do it. I promise you. <gasps> okay. <laughs> Remember when the stream was about playing escape rooms? Okay. Can you see you in five hours when you finish the jump? Hey, come back here. Come back here. Canadian, you got confirmation on the map maker. There's nothing there. Lies. <laughs> You're lying. Okay, I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I don't care. I don't care. We're going back. We're going back. I was here earlier. Okay. All right. Why? Okay. Look, see? Do you see this? This is not accidental parkour. There's a staircase here. There's literally, this is all slabs. You're lying. This is all slabs and then a staircase. There's something here. Okay, maybe there's not. I thought I thought this staircase led somewhere. Uh, unless, can you? Oh, wait. Is that possible? But you can't open the door. <gasps> Advancement? They have advanced. Oh, they have custom advancements. Wait. 
a mere remnant with a fraction of its former power. There's no way this helps me in the map, does it? I'm wearing these, at least. Okay, so this is like... Oh, there's particles, too. Okay, this is like a completely formal, like, full-on map. This is a full-on adventure map. Like, with uh, whole sorts of stuff built into it. You know, big animations and texture changes and whatnot. What? What? <laughs> Canadian confirmed hacker. He hit the jump button correctly. I didn't che Okay, I'm not going to cheat in the actual thing. We're in the lobby. It doesn't matter, guys. We're in the lobby. I just wanted to... I'm not going to cheat in the actual escape room. Also, I'm pretty sure we're not going to have to deal with hard parkour. So... Uh, I'm scared. I feel like this isn't going to be a good map. I mean, for a stream. I don't know. I Okay, let's see. Welcome to our <gasps> there's n Hold on. shoot. There's narration. Wait. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be. Listen. Oh, I didn't know this was the kind of map with narration. No, it's not done yet though. I mean, half the mechanics don't work. Oh, I've seen. I've literally seen this trope before. This trope has been done before. Of this map is incomplete. It's fine. That's good. But I've seen that before. Welcome to. We haven't actually decided what our name is. Wait. I was playing around with the idea of the plausible Wait. Theory, so I might as well show you. Let me know if you think it's cool. <gasps> okay. Okay, there, this feels like the map maker is just flexing. <laughs> that was just a flex. Oh no. Oh, we're playing like full on RPG MMO. <laughs> What? Are we gonna have to talk to NPCs? Uh, okay. I will take oak planks. Okay, hang on. First, first things first. First, first problem, bud. Alright, they've probably checked. I mean, this is a seven month in the making map. And they've completely thoroughly checked for, like, bugs. But this, it looks like it's so easy to get out of this map. I just want to briefly check. Because it looks like you can get out of the map. Which, hmm. Like, you can you can literally F5 over this. You can see the spawn area. <laughs> That's the spawn. <laughs> okay. I will find a way to break out of this map. It looks like... I want... Oh, no, that's a quad. That's a quad, Neo. Okay, okay. Hmm. Hmm. Bro. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm assuming I'm still in adventure too. Yes. Okay. I'm still adventure mode. Uh. Something here. Something here. I just gotta check every wall real quick. Then we'll actually play legit. Hmm. You can't make that. Okay. Hmm. Is this possible? Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. We can get on the stairs. Wait. Yeah. What? Is there... There's a barrier. This map uses barrier blocks. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. If there's barriers, there's no point. There's probably barriers up here. Ah, <sighs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, it uses barriers. Okay. Well, what's in here? Uh, can I pick this up? What? Wait. Press F to highlight all blocks necessary for the puzzle. F. F. You needed a hint after 7 minutes and 23 seconds. I mean, what do you mean? What? That was not seven minutes. That was okay. It's a pre-recorded message, but whatever. Okay. Okay. Wait. So, what does green mean? Destroy. Okay. Red is storage. I don't see any red. Oranges interact. Okay. I can't interact with it. Am I doing something wrong? 
There was a spot a minute ago where you could maybe jump from a wall to a slab. Hmm. It took me an hour to beat on my first go. Okay. The whole map, right? Not the first level. There's... Wait, I checked this earlier. There's not many achievements. So it's probably not that long. Barrier cringe. I agree. I actually hate barriers. I never use barriers. Actually, that's not entirely true. Oh, there's going to be something hidden in the waterfall. I think. No, that's dirt. Okay, never mind. <gasps> no, there is something hidden here. You found a secret. Here's the thing. This message is split down to first secret you find, whether that be in the first level or the last. Therefore, my colleague will now deliver four pieces of dialogue. Kindly block your ears for the three that you have. Helm an armor? An armor? This is, you found the secret on your very first level. You must have a good attention to detail. Wait, what's going on? We'll deliver four. Well, 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 you found a secret. Oh, it's just a... S okay. I mean, you found one, I guess. Oh, wait, so this is one of the achievements. Okay. We got an achievement. This was the easiest one. Gotta say, not impressed. Level four. Okay. This is not gonna stop narrating. This is just gonna narrate forever. We're really playing an escape room here. This is... I'm really... I really feel like I'm escaping here. Oh, you just have to leave, and he shuts up. Okay. That's pretty good. Nothing you can break. Uh, where have we not gone? I guess down here. Ah, right. Forgot to tell you about the construction work. There's a big hole in the middle of the level, but it seems you figured that out. Can break oak wood. Wait, for real? Oh, just wait. Wait, there's nothing there. Is there any oak wood? There's here. Can you use oak wood anywhere to escape? You probably can't. And there's nothing hidden here or there. Okay. Now it can break campfire. Did it change? Huh? Okay, that's weird. So now we can break campfire. Why? Okay, wait, cause Chark. Wait a minute. Oh! I'm so smart. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. It uses fuel to lower. Oh, the crane's lowering. So, does this just find all the hidden coal? Right, okay, because there's coal here. And we use the furnace. You can make coal. We can make coal with this, obviously. Um, put this on top. Oh, you don't even need to smelt it. Yep. I already know that one. That's pretty straightforward. And now we have to get the the last one somehow um can't make a pickaxe no yes we can we yeah well but it's not gonna have the effect it's not gonna have the tag to destroy coal so um right Unless it's programmed in. I don't know how much faith I have that it's programmed in to make it so. Would they, is that a thing they program in? Canadian is indeed the smartest player. Thank you, thank you. I actually want to check up on that last guy from earlier who said that uh, Rec Rap was the smartest player. Did he ever respond to me? Well, anyway, since I can't find his message, I'm going to assume he, um, uh, I'm going to assume I won the argument. Make a pickaxe? Okay, well, Vixios has played this map, so I'm going to trust him. But also, wait, how? There's a crafting table up there, I remember. Okay, so it is coded in somehow? 
Oh, it is. Okay. Can break stone? Okay. And then we make... Okay. Okay, so can you break stone to exploit this? Yes. No, you can't. Because it doesn't break cobble. Oh, shoot. Wait. Hmm. Hmm. No, you can't. Well, no, maybe... If we broke that... If we broke that stone... Wait, shoot. I... Did I soft lock? <laughs> uh, <clears throat> no, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I know I didn't. I can pick it up. It's just gonna be hard to pick up. I should not have broken that one. I might have soft locked. I might have done a little bit of soft lock. Oh, no, I picked it up. I picked it up! I picked it up. Okay. Yeah, that jump's not possible. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I thought there might be a way you could break the stone and find a way to escape. So now I guess we make a stone pickaxe. This seems pretty straightforward. And it breaks color. Okay, cool. Pretty easy. I guess this is the warm up to the mechanics. So now, yo guys, I just mined charcoal ore. I just got charcoal from mining. And then we can get over the gap. And these are all locked. Okay, you gotta flip your trap doors. Life lesson, always flip your trap doors. There's nothing there. Okay, what does this do? It's gone. I thought that was gonna do something. I thought it was gonna be like a quest or something. Okay. That's a, uh, yep, sure. Good job. Good job. Yes. Anyway. Uh, thank you, thank you. The devs have been experimenting with a pod mechanic, so I'll let you play around with that. Pardon? Auto TNT? Okay. Hmm. So I'm gonna find like a shovel or something. No, oh, <gasps> jeez! Oh my god! Needed them so often they've started charging me one for the price of two. <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> Wait, what does this button do then? Hmm? Okay. Hmm. Did I miss something? Is there like a tool just on the ground? So oh! Oh, there's a barrel. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, makes sense. Cool. Barrels are hard to see. <laughs> I'm gonna pay more attention to the walls now. But, okay. Four sand, four gravel, and a pause? I have a pause? Right click to pause all entities and movement. I can still move. It's wrong. It's factually incorrect. I can I can literally move. Bro. Whatever. Anyway, um I'm going to make gray concrete because it's in the crafting grid. <laughs> so I think that's a hint that I'm supposed to use the pause button. That is not funny. I give you That is not funny. I give you revolutionary mechanic can you wish it. Yeah. Works with me. Yep. Okay. Why don't I place it there, though? What? Did it just phase through the button? Huh? Huh? I don't like this map. Wait, seriously? Is this not a real button? It is. Okay. Okay. Oh, is this just so I can't get it back? All right. Is this a magma? This is a magma cube. 
What? Who put the magma cube? Who put the magma cube in the wall? Why is it? What's he doing there? You're playing on baby mode and still struggling? What do you mean baby mode? What? Is there a harder difficulty? Vixio? Is there, is, am, am I on actually easy mode? Is there a more difficult mode? It seems... Okay. Or do you just mean, because I have the this on? The clue, oh, that's a clue thing. Well, how else are you supposed to know what's useful? Like, in the earlier area. Like, I didn't know the campfire. Well, I guess I didn't know the campfire was useful until I got the axe. Should I just turn it off and find things without it? You have all the hints. Oh. Okay, I didn't understand how the hint thing worked. Wait, how do I turn off hints? Just F? Okay. Okay, no more hints. We're playing on hard mode. Then again, I also know there's something in here. Water. Okay, it can only be placed on magma cube. I was gonna say, water is a bit sussy for an escape room. Which, you know, escape room is a stretch of a term here, but you, it can be placed on magma cube. Right. So, all right. Okay. Is this... <gasps> Is there barriers again? There's barriers again! What's the point of placing water here? Okay. Okay, there's sand, though. Hmm. Can't get up there. Okay. Hmm. I was thinking... Like, the idea of making concrete powder intrigues me, but you can't... Wait, no, I can make concrete powder. Because... Yes, this can be placed on deep slate bricks. Yeah. Okay. But... This can only be placed on tough and piston. Huh? And this can only be placed on magma cube. What? Okay. I feel like we're still learning what some of the puzzle mechanics are. I guess I, this is a new one. You can you can launch you can launch gray concrete powder. That is a thing now. Which all right. I, I'm assuming we're still in like the warm-up levels. Yeah, great job, Adama. But I don't understand how you're so comfortable without the pause button. Oh, he just gave me the pause button back, guys. We're gonna make more gray concrete. Yeah, that was very confusing. Try not thinking in regular Minecraft rules. Well, yeah, I, I know it's like pre-coded and stuff, and we just have to learn what the coded and stuff is. Like, maybe we'll use this pause button, but. Yeah, you just have to know what the rules are. So, I uh, we're learning the physics. I shall pull the lever. Replenishing Ender Pearl. Huh? Okay, fine. Oh, <laughs> out of bounds. <laughs> Fair. Really? No. No. Okay, I can kind of move with it. Also, okay, what's in here? Toto coding. Add region detection for returning pause. Done. Widen level two transition zone. Done. Ha ha ha, get it? Because they're still building it. So this is like the to do. Gunpowder. Oh, TNT. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got to mine in one of those. What's in here? I got an ender pearl. I can go anywhere. There's nothing here. Wait, we can escape. We can pearl glitch. <gasps> huh? What? <laughs> what? 
<laughs> no way. No way. <laughs> it won't let me go anywhere with this. <laughs> I actually broke out of the map. <laughs> Is this intentional? Does this actually lead somewhere? Wait, wait, wait. It probably leads somewhere. <laughs> oh, no, but I can't throw the pearl. Look, you can see the models of the crane. We can see some tree model. Uh, we can see uh, the gate opening. Or... I don't know what that is. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can get back in. Okay, I can. Okay, good. Okay, we're back. We're back. We're back. <laughs> we're back. That I don't. Okay, I don't know if that's intentional, but at least we know how to. We know how to exit the map if that's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to do that. We just need to find one more sand, though. I can get around a lot easier with this pearl. Any sand? There's a pressure plate. Door opened. Oh! Oh! Wait, there's a room behind that. Huh. And I'm assuming items won't... Yeah, yeah, items won't hold it down. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Hmm... Where's the last sand? I don't want to. I don't want this to just be a looking puzzle. Oh, it's probably behind the door, isn't it? Yo, wait, guys. Wait. Okay, guys. I've had like two realizations at the same time. Someone just said, "Can you pearl into the room?" Exactly what I'm thinking. I just realized. I think what the solution is is to throw the pearl and then use the pause button. So you can step on the pressure plate? I think that's it. But, as someone mentioned, I'm pretty sure you can just pearl glitch into the room. Am I going up? Oh, I just barely didn't make it. I did it wrong. I did. I just did it wrong. I, I'll do it right this time. I know how I did it. I know how I did it. Yeah, I have it set up wrong again. Because I'm glitching through this instead of through the... That's what I gotta do. Hmm. Do you think they patched this? Do you think they actually have a way to counter pearl glitching? Somewhere in the code? I coded it so you can't pearl glitch in my map. No, I got in. <laughs> okay. We broke their map. Let's go. Yeah, there was an endermite. I don't see it anymore. It probably got killed. There's the gunpowder. Can fish primed TNT. Hmm. I wonder then what we're going to do with uh, all these ingredients. That was great. <laughs> Broken times two. You know, they used to have monitors around here. But with the new policy of paying tax. They remove them all. All that's left is my voice. Oh, monitors for the face. That would be interesting. Imagine having, like, full-on Wheatley monitors that you could break. Okay, so let's go to the crafting table. Where's the crafting table? Last one I remember is, like, over here. This is such a broken map already. And we're just in the warm-up. We're just in the training levels. Wait, no. Oh, here's the last crafting table. Either that or that was all intentional. Who knows? Strong enough to shatter weak walls. Weak walls. Excuse me? What do you mean by weak walls? Also, can I, can I do this water thing now that there's not barriers? Oh, I can. So the concrete was useless. When you place the concrete, the barrier just disappears. And now I can do the water thing. Okay, I'll be honest, I have a gripe with that. Because this feels like it just really wants you to just do this puzzle this exact way. And then it makes it so you can't do it. Which, just making it so you can't do it one way 
is not as good as making it s like that. I, I mean, okay, I should I should phrase my wording better. It's not making it's not preventing using water to swim up. It's just denying that option. It completely denies that option, even though it's totally possible. But now that you did it the intended way, yeah, now you can now you can do it the way you wanted to do it earlier. That's kind of dumb. But I like the coding so far. I should complement this map a bit more. Uh, wait. What can you place this on? Oh, on polished deep slate. Polished deep slate, which is not this deep slate. It is strictly not this deep slate. It is this deep slate. Oh, it's out of TNT though. And it breaks weak walls. I just want to see what it does. Because I assume you get it back. Nothing. Okay. And then we've got the fishing rod, which can... That... Okay. So by weak walls, I assume it doesn't mean these kind of walls. I assume it means these kind of walls. So let's just... Pull it in here. Oh! Oh! Pause time! And pull the TNT. And then we can get to the next level. That's cool. Okay. I'll give the map a compliment for that. That's pretty neat. Uh. Wait. Uncover the ancient. Oh, is this just an Easter egg? Is that it? We just found the second. We just found the second hidden room. I think that's all we did. Uh, eh. hmm. There was a thing above. What? When I'm gonna assume that was earlier. Okay, it has let us out. Hmm. Okay. Ah, yep. Yep. Ah, yep. Yep. No, I got it. Pause time, do parkour, that's neat. All right, so we've learned piston mechanics and TNT mechanics. Boom, epic, and pause mechanics. That Those are all cool mechanics. No, wait, don't give me blindness, wait. What? Oh, right. Oh, I remember that being a way that, like, maps do transitions. I forgot that was, like, an actual thing. Uh, I don't play adventure maps like this. Elevator, out of order. Huh? And yet you still go, and you still try it. Oh, okay, so the elevator kills you. Wait, but it goes up. But it kills you. So the elevator goes up, but it kills you. Cool. That's not really out of order so much as it is completely functional elevator that kills it. Unless it, like, drops down. Maybe that's it. Like, it goes up, and then it drops, and then you die of fall damage. Hmm? Okay. Well, let's play the map now. Right. Torch can be placed on smooth quartz. Uh, map can break torch. Okay. So I can place the torch anywhere and break it. Nice. Ah, yeah, it's just going to break the snow. Big drip leaf can be placed on dripstone block. Okay, pretty straightforward. Pretty simple. Very simple. Cool. Mm-hmm. Do, do, do. White banner can be placed on purple concrete powder. Slime block can be placed on sticky piston. Uh, rest in peace, infinite game breaking ender pearl. That oh yeah, you're right. We don't have the tor. We don't have the ender pearl anymore. It removed all our stuff. No. <laughs> uh. 
Yeah. I mean, I guess we're on, like, level 2 now. So. Uh, right. Let's get the torch, obviously. I was gonna get the... Nope, we can't get the torch anymore. Hmm. Yeah, that's fair. Can we glitch into the shulker? We can't. Anything else? This level is so buggy. This level is buggy? Shoot. Really? Okay. Oh. Oh. How high does this go? Uh-huh. Okay, so we just go to... Let's just go to this first room. Nope. First room. Nope. Oh. First room. Yes. That's how we do it. Uh-huh, and there's a bunch of doors, and we're just going to keep going up. Okay. Uh. <laughs> there's a lot of items. Oh, my gosh. Guys, we got Ender Pearls back. Let's go. Let's go. Glitch Ender Pearl. Escape. What? Guys, it's an infinite Ender Pearl again. Hang on. No, stop. I'm trying to break your map. Ah, uh, where, where can we glitch? <sighs> okay. Hang on. This this kind of gives a bit of a hint, though. Yep. Yeah. No, I already figured this out. Just based off the six crying obsidian, that's obviously a respawn anchor. Okay. Wait, you just make a bunch of explosives. Okay. Crafting puzzle. Do, do, do. We could also just click on these. All right, just, I, we got the TNT back, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and you could also make gun, fa yeah, fire charge. Okay. Can we play some blast furnace, crying obsidian, netherite, obsidian? What's this gonna break? That was not the block I expected it to break, but... Oh. Right. And then what? Can we place on Blast Furnace? Yeah. Okay, so let's just make a bunch of explosives. How do I make it blow up? Oh, we got it. Suspicious Shulker Box. And we got our next banner? Okay, let's save. Let's store these. Let's store these in this slot. And then we'll get our suspicious shulker box. They can be placed on endstone bricks, which is right here. Uh, can't place it there. It, it'll only let me place it in the right place. I will admit, at least this map is good at stopping you from soft locking. And who would have guessed it's a shulker? Yeah, no, this has a, like a ton of patches for soft locking. Really well. I just checked the spreadsheet and you're in the top 99. Yo, guys, we're in the top what? We're in the top 0.1%. We're in the top percentile. Oh, wait, he means 99.9 .9 is in. Oh, he means he means there's only one in a thousand players that's worse than us. Oh. <gasps> Eureka's here. Hey. I, I think I broke your map earlier. I'm not sure. It's probably... I mean, it's like patched, wor broken out. But... Yeah, sorry it took me so many months. <laughs> no, we just glitched out with the pearl. But I assume, based on the fact that I couldn't get anywhere with that, that it's patched. But that's a thing that exists. Also... Yeah, never mind. I think I cheesed the copper room too, but I'm not sure. I don't know how much is like known glitches. And how much is, um, wait, is there something here? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Ah, ha, ha. Okay. I know all this redstone's useless. That's pretty obvious. Like, because you don't set up redstone like this to have a purpose. It's just distraction. Oh. 
Combination. Okay. I need to learn to read. <laughs> There's a sign that literally says combination lock and I didn't read it. Hi, Canadian. Was there any hoppers, Wink? Uh, not any hoppers I could open. Yeah, it wasn't so much cheesed, the, the pearl one. Like, because I still had to use ender pearls to get through it, I just didn't do it the way I think you were supposed to. Which I assume is like pausing and throwing it. But... How do we get the combination? I've literally done a map like this. Wait, I did a map exactly like this in chamber eight of the 150 player escape room. And the solution was at five. And I doubt that's going to be the solution here. But <laughs> that's the first thing that comes to mind. Because it was actually it. It was just a bunch of decorative redstone. But then you had to look for the combination lock in a different room. Like you had to figure out the password in F5. Okay. Yeah, I don't expect I don't expect that to actually be it. That would be crazy if it was the same. Look at the lights. Fixios, don't tell me. Okay. Okay, I can see the lights in the ceiling. Man, man, man spoiled it. Okay. I should stop reading chat crusher an item infused with the power to make you collapse at a mere touch <gasps> no way wait infinite crusher exploit okay we're going in here we're going in here <gasps> diffused slime ball capable of increasing the power of a piston oh i know where i'm using you buddy i'm using you on this piston okay no i can't I can't do that one. <gasps> How high does this go? Wait, let's like crawl midair. Okay. Okay, that didn't work. That didn't work out very well. All right, let's go to number three. Uh, prototype. To prototype map. This was our original <clears throat> planning for the builds. There's build one, over there is build two. And at the back is the build you're in right now. Hmm, okay. Wait, I can't... Right. That's fine. Oh, I get it. Oh, this is cute. That's cute. Level 2. With the button that does nothing. And the cave. With gravel. And the Hey, we're just playing the same map again. Wait, actually, I should be checking if there's oak wood that I can break that gets me places. I just have to check if there is. Oh, I can't break that. Oh, th but this tree is the only thing that's made of oak wood. There's got to be something hidden. There's always something hidden. Okay, I don't think there's anything hidden there. I'm just mining. I don't know what I'm doing with the oak logs. Oh, is this just going to be the same solution? Is there coal? There's probably coal. There is. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we learned this. We learned this earlier. We learned how to make pickaxes in Minecraft. I love making pickaxe in Minecraft. And then this can make brick stone. Oh, oh yeah, sure. But when they, but then when you get the pickaxe, you conveniently put stone slabs over here. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. Such a. This one's also stone slabs. Oh my gosh. Such a cheap. I mean, it works. Coal breaking pickaxe, used exclusively for breaking coal. Okay. Wait, what do I do? Wait, do I not use the charcoal here? We do not use the charcoal there. Hmm. Sand. Is there... My, I'm drawing a blank. Is there a shovel and I missed it? Oh my gosh! 
the second time the second time literally last time when we were in the original section i couldn't see this barrel and it happened again i missed this barrel uh creator wants me to press l i have actually found i think all three assuming these come in order yeah not to brag but i do a little bit of exploring I only got two armor pieces. I had the boots. I guess they disappeared because I got them in the lobby. But I hope I didn't miss the one in this level already. So, so, okay. We got shovel, shovel. All right. Get ahead in the game. Gravel. We got gravel. Gravel can be placed on tough. Tough. Oh, it doesn't fall this time. Finally. Epic. Let's break the sand. The sand can be smelted into glass and it only took one somehow then we use the gravel to get into level three which is the level we are already in we enter this room where we do the puzzle from earlier but this time we get six white wool uh oh we're gonna make a banner yeah we're gonna make a banner um Oh, oh, and then we got the crusher, and then we use the crusher to access this and get the slime block that we place on this thing. And then we launch up to this area. Ah, welcome to the prototype. Bro. <laughs> the prototype of our map. Okay. This was our original plan okay. For the planning of the build. Okay, cute. Again? Enter the prototype level within the prototype. Oh, that's too much of this. Okay. Wait, let's check everything in here first. Oh no. Uh, okay. Okay, wait, there's a shulker there. Alright, a bit buggy. Prototype of a prototype of a prototype. We have to get in there. Okay, but let's go back, because I have an idea. I think if we find the last sand, yes, here it is. I saw that, and then I didn't mine it. But I saw it, like in my head, I consciously, I looked at it, but I was distracted with other things. See, because we have sand, and therefore, obviously, we can make a potion of jump boost. Yes, very simple, very, very easy, very intuitive. I'm just that smart and intelligent, and where's their water? Shoot. Where is water? Right here. Right. Right. Yes. Yes. And then I bet they're going to code it so that you can... Wait, I need the nether one. Do I have something that can break it? I'm being gaslit. I'm being gaslit. There's no way that was there the whole time. I swear it only said you can break oak wood. That had to have changed. Okay. I, I might just be blind, but... Okay, nice. Quick speed run brewing. Very fast brewing. We also need a... We need um, glowstone, though. <sighs> Never mind. Um, right, hang on, hang on. Just give me one minute. Uh, sh something IRL. I live in real life. Give me like five seconds. I'm gonna AFK here, and you guys can listen to, um, you guys can listen to Nintendo Me theme. Not the ad that plays before it, though. <laughs> we'll, we'll jump into the... Let, let, we'll, we'll, we'll frame this as stay tuned and when we're back we will jump into the prototype of a prototype and see what's in there uh okay bye <laughs>
we return. Last off, we, we left off wondering what could possibly be in the prototype of a prototype of a prototype of a... I lost track. Let's see. Is it the next level? Or is it another prototype? Uh, welcome to the prototype. The prototype of the prototype. <gasps> yes! 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 We found the next one. We found the fourth one. Wait, that, wait so we're this close to the end? We're close to the end. Huh? Okay, the map is shorter than I thought it was going to be. Did you see the video plighting made of the Hopper Prison debunk? Yes, I did. I did. Uh, coming up next. Yeah, all right. You are missing some item that you will need later. I don't know what you mean. Okay, wait, let me briefly check here. Okay, I, I don't believe it. Oh, yes, yes, right, we need the leggings. We got the leggings. That should be everything in here, because it said this is just a secret. You were missing some items you need. Oh, that's what you mean. You were missing some... Okay, you're right, you're right. What am I missing, then? I have to make a banner. I know that. I just remembered that. We, just, we have to make the banner. Real quick. Let's make some sticks. And it's going to automatically turn into an orange banner. Nice. Nice coating. Um, we're still missing something. Uh, shoot. Do we need to craft something else? I can still mine wood, so I probably still need wood. Did I forget? Can I grab this? I can't grab that. Barrel's empty. Wait, shoot, what am I missing? What am I... Did I miss... You guys said earlier in chat there was something I was like obviously missing. Is there something I didn't grab? I'll say this level... This this map does actually do a good job of soft locking. Or, or not soft locking. I mean preventing soft locks. Sorry, that's what I meant. Because like... Wait, I just want to see if there's something, like, under the shulker box. Do I have to set my spawn? Okay. What did I obviously miss? Okay. You broke the map. You weren't meant... You were meant to have four less planks and one more log. I broke it. <sighs> Uh, that's not good. Oh. Wait, really? This map was advertised as like almost impossible to soft lock in. Well, I will consider myself successful or very dumb. I don't know why I crafted these. I just crafted all my logs into planks because. Okay. Should we just cheat in a log? Use the uncrafting table. Is there an uncrafting table? Guys, let's just uncraft it. We can't uncraft it. Oh, we have to make a campfire. Uh. Huh. Huh. Rare Canadian L. Rare placeholder L. No one has ever done that. <laughs> no one has ever done that. <laughs> Dang. Sorry, no one has ever made that mistake. We just, okay. <laughs> uh... And the door open. Uh... Wait, where do we even go? We have jump boost. Wait, okay. To yellow, I think. Unless we can go to green. Yeah, I guess we do yellow. Evoker. Boss fight. 
uh, reset. Huh? Oh, so that's why we needed the campfire. Okay, wait, so camp... Shoot, jeez, wait. Campfire can be placed on coal. Flint and steel can be placed on yellow concrete. We see yellow concrete. Or, well, concrete. Not... Yeah, anyway. This can be placed on yellow concrete. This can be placed on pointed dripstone, yellow concrete powder, TNT, quartz brick. So... Okay. Place TNT on quartz brick. Dripstone. Then what can be placed on dripstone? This. We made a mistake. We made a mistake. That didn't happen. That didn't happen. This first. Oh, and then you damage it. Oh, I kind of like that. So you just have to damage it as many ways as possible. And that's why I needed to miss that. That's weird. Anyway, okay, so we got two. Then we need to do this. Then we need to do this. Then with this. And then he blows up and that kills. Or Okay, and that kills him. Perfect, perfect. That one's neat. That one's a neat puzzle. Concrete under evoker. Yes. That was such a hard boss fight. Now, how do we use a totem? Is there something? Okay, wait. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I better make that jump, yeah. <laughs> if I miss that, I don't know if I can get the totem back. Boss fight again. This time versus laser end rod. Laser cutter. Okay. Hmm? Wait. Oh, so this is a cover the whole map puzzle. That's cool. Um, I'm going to pick this one up. Because I bet that one probably not isn't necessarily supp <clears throat> supposed to be there. So. Wait, am I right? Yeah, I'm right. Right. Now, the way you do these, the way you do this is you find the ones that can only be reached in one place. So, for example, this block. You see how I can't place one here or here? There's no way to power this block, except for here, which means the only way this one's going to turn gold is if there's a block here, and therefore I'm 100% confident that that's the first one, and I don't have to remove it. Next, now I know you can't place one here, uh, from this direction or from that direction because that's in the way so you'd only be able to do it from here or here and placing it here doesn't make any sense so the next one must go there I think that's it so far next this one can be reached from here or here those are the only two places placing it here just makes more sense because it reaches more next uh, probably something like this Mm, this one's kind of unsure. It could go here or here, I think. This one could also be powered either way. Huh. Gaming. Just use F5. Oh my gosh, I've gained a whole new perspective and I now know. Oh wait, this one. This one can... No. Because I don't know if you have to place it like this. Maybe I'm overthinking it. I'm probably overthinking it. I'm overthinking it. That's it. That's the solution. I got it. Easy. And now we do it again. I will pick this one up. Wait. Actually, I want to see what this does. Huh? 
Oh, the arrow's on the other side. So this time you can move the laser. Right, you can move the laser now with the arrows. How many do we get? Bro. <laughs> Bro, you really pulled the popped chorus fruit blaze rod thing. Who's, who's going to come to this level? We're on like level 10. Who's going to get this far? And look at popped chorus fruit and blaze rod and be like, dang, I have, I have no idea what to craft. I, <laughs> you might, yeah, I can't complain too much, but that one was kind of required zero brain energy. Okay. Well, I know how the thing works. I want to remove this and think this spot cannot be reached by any of the arrows. It cannot be reached from here, here or here. So we'll place the first one there. That one's certain. There has to be one here. Now, the only way that these blocks are getting hit. Well, actually, no, that's not certain. You could place them here, but I'm pretty sure the arrows are not decoration. So I think it would only make sense for one to be here, but I won't place it yet since I don't know for certain right here. Here's a good one. Oh, here's a good one. So yeah, this block can't be powered except for this direction. And that doesn't really make sense. So, and it can't be powered from anywhere except from here. So if we want to power this block, you can either put a laser here or a laser here. And pretty straightforward. This one covers more and we're not sacrificing any blocks. So this one's just objectively better of the two options. Therefore, this one has to be correct. Okay. I didn't explain my logic perfectly, but I think it makes sense. I think you can infer what I'm saying. This one can't be powered from there or here or here. So one has to go there. And then this block, this one's unsure too, but I might also just be overthinking it again. I bet it's that. Yeah, I'm, I'm way overthinking. This is so simple. Nice. <gasps> Yo, crawl mode glitch, crawl mode exploit discovered. And we get the next banner and a ladder that can be placed on calcite. What does calcite look like? Oh, that. Yeah, right. Right. Cool. GG. This is like a million times slower than his edited videos. Yeah, that's because of my videos. I speak super fast, so I don't lose retention. I go, and then I realized, yeah, you got to speak like alms is cool. So people don't click off. That's not actually true. You can speak slow and people will still watch, but I still speak fast. Wait, it just grew. Oh, sure. Yeah. Ladders grow. Minecraft logic. Oh, this is the final room. Wait, now I'm kind of worried that I might have missed an achievement. No, tip of the tower. We're not at the tip of the tower. Unless it's referring to something else, but I think it's here. So, okay, okay, hang on, hang on. Let's not freak out yet. I just want to make sure I get every achievement because we got all of them except one. So, user manual combination lock. After installation, look, your, fo your lock follows a two-step mechanism. Place all banners on the respective powder. This will reveal each banner symbol. Continue to the next page. Use the vault decoder image to manually decode symbols. If you want to spin a correct setup, it will custom message location or even a location, if you fail to complete these steps, refer to page three. Page three. Hmm. Ken's next one will be how many banners do we need to make a chunk bin? I don't know if you can, you, I don't think you can do it with banners. I'll be honest. They, you really can't put a lot of ba data into banners. Like the amount of data is all way smaller than it looks like. Colorblind person would lose here. But no, you can, you can check an F3. You can see what they look like. Um, so, oh, it's, they're colored blue. Oh, it's just an order. Okay. So that, okay. I get the symbols, I get symbols and then wait. Oh, 
So we scale the map and then we get the code. Okay, that's very simple. Okay, orange equals Y. Yellow equals E. Then L, another L, it just says yellow, doesn't it? Yellow, yellow, like the eggs from that one, like kids video, yellow. Symbols of custom message or even a location. <gasps> wait, wait, 5,000 IQ. Let's go to yellow. The location of yellow. I'm a genius. Okay, you're really getting on my nerves. Oh, that was right. All those hotel rooms just to return to the yellow one. Oh, <laughs> I was half joking. <laughs> I mean, oh, okay, I'm squealing. I'm like voice cracking. Okay, so. I was trying to tell you was that the build team really messed up the world a bit. No. Anyway, your goal here is to make it. Huh? I would appreciate oh. it if you did it without completely Sorry. destroying the mansion. I thought this was gonna like do some kind of funky like glitch rotation like like trying to move your your camera would rotate <laughs> i was like i was about to quit i'm gonna throw up but someone says say my user please i will deny that request because you're begging are you a furry because your name is Catboy? no i'm not a furry i'm not a furry that's so trippy every time i look at this i want to walk up it is there anything in the barrel there's not Okay. <gasps> Wait! <gasps> yes! Yes! Let's go! We can escape! We can escape! Oh. Guys, watch this. Parkour! <gasps> okay, so you can't die. They've they've patched suicide. Um. Hmm? Trident? Okay, so you guys can you can craft tridents in Minecraft now. Guys, look at me. Hello, yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy. Um, crafting recipe. Um, <laughs> look at this. It looks like I'm the crafting recipe. So, um, <laughs> it literally looks like I'm the crafting recipe. <laughs> There's a bottle here. Can't get it, of course. Okay. Well, let's check every container. Quick. Speed run the last bit of the map. We have to beat it in under an hour so we can beat Vixios' first time. What's in this door? It's outside again. What's in this place? Axe that can break birch planks. Armor. Which I can't get. Crawl mode glitch. Ender chest with nothing in it. Can I put things in it? I can, but that does nothing. Locked barrel, locked barrel, locked barrel. Why would you lock your barrels? How do you lock a barrel? They don't have a lock. You just open the lid. Why is the bottle cooked? That is a real good question. I don't know why we aren't asking this question. Who's cooking a bottle? Do you have to cook experience? For it to... You only... Your only use is telling people how to make a trident. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you just walk up to people and you're like, in case you forgot. Imagine being the crafting recipe for, like, planks or something. You'd be so lonely in life. No one cares. They're like, I know how to make planks. I don't need your help. You'd be useless. This guy's already useless. Now I know how to make a trident, so I don't need him. So wait, this cra this birch planks, right? Uh, let's go upstairs and see if we can find some birch planks. <gasps> there is a birch plank. I broke it. Oh, these are the ones we're probably supposed to break. Next area. We do trapdoor parkour to get up. Okay, no, there's more birch planks. Never mind. And a barrel. Pay attention to barrels. I gotta pay attention to barrels. And that just goes back down there. I opened that. Right. I haven't broken the map in a long time. I'll be honest. I thought this was gonna be just breaking everything in the map. 
like we did in the first area, but I have not broken the map in a long time. It has held up for a while. I really expected more glitching and exploiting, but they patched most things. They seriously patched most things. Every time, everything I tried breaking, except for pearl glitching into the like copper area and stuff, which I think was half like known, and they probably just didn't care as much. Okay, where do we go? In here. Wait, is there something under a trap door? This is kind of disappointing. I wanted to break the map more. All I did was find one of the very few soft locks in the entire world. You missed a plank? Ken, you can break campfires? I'm being gaslit. I promise you I'm being gaslit. How do I miss this? How do I miss this? Ah. Okay, we can break the campfire. A giant bottle of experience holds more experience than usual. Okay. Five? That's crazy. I wonder if we'll use that to enchant a trident, maybe? Okay. Okay. I'm just looping around the same area. There's never anything hidden behind trapdoors. Chat is freaking out. What do you want? Canady blonde? You missed an air pocket. <gasps> what do you mean? I'm not blind. I've been in here. Okay, okay, look. Let's look very carefully. I've been there. There's nothing here. All right, let's go up. Let's go up, all right? I'll tell you. I'll show you who's blind. I will show you who's blind. There's nothing here. Nothing there. Been there. Been here. Let's go back up here. I can't get in there. I've been there. That was an area I already mentioned. Oh my gosh. Okay. Cut that part out. Okay. Nothing. It's a crevice. It's just a crevice that leads to nothing. It's a crevice that leads nowhere. We're stuck. We can't parkour to the side. There's no birch planks except for up there. What are you saying now? Canadian, you missed Barrel Boy? No, 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 no. If you saw a barrel, I already opened it, I think. Pro wait, unless there's a barrel in the wall? Is there anything else this can break? Just birch planks and campfire. Oh. Oh. What do you want? A valuable gem. For Riptide. Yeah, we're gonna make a Riptide Trident. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. This just leads out. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. There's a villager now. There's nothing in this room. What do you want now? Can check the M's? Shut up. Okay, but I'll also check the M's. Probably not accessible. Yeah, I can't reach that right now. I can go see if I can look at that room from another angle. Okay, this is the only way out. So that room is up there. I'll be honest, you guys are freaking out about this so much. I'm calm. I fell down. There's literally, I have checked every single trapdoor in this entire map. Every trapdoor. I've checked all of them. Except for that one. What? Okay, you can't even say you saw that. You didn't even see that one. And when you're talking about being blind, that's not even, that's, that's all of us. We all missed that one. Probably. Can break moss block and dead bush. Okay. 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 
I'm calm. Guys, you guys are the ones that are freaking out, I swear. <laughs> you guys are the ones who are getting worked up over this. I'm trying to be civil. <laughs> That's so stupid. You cannot believe... If we check the statistics for how many trap doors I have flipped... Where is it? Trap... Oh, they don't even show here. General. There's gotta be at T. Trap doors flipped, right? Trap... They don't have one for trap doors flipped. Okay. But I've, I've flipped many a trap door in my day, and I did not flip the one, the one where something was hidden. Go back to the roof area. You guys say roof area, like I haven't been on the roof the whole time. Also, I remember where it is. I just spaced out. It's over here. Yep, there's the moss block. Boom. What can the moss block be placed on? Spruce leaves. Got it. We place it on the spruce leaves, and then we leave. Okay, probably not. Is there any other spruce leaves in the map? That was so dumb. I'm I'm gonna flip every trap door out of pure rage. I, I I can see what's on the other side. I'm just I'm gonna flip them anyway. You know, maybe there's something in that barrel. Maybe that was the one that wasn't locked. Okay, I don't see spruce leaves. Except here. Maybe there's something hidden there. Maybe there's something hidden there. Maybe there's something hidden there. Maybe there's something in the back. Right I don't know. Because now I'm paranoid of every trap door. <sighs> oh, baby. This is where... Is that what you were talking about? This is probably where you were saying I was blind. I couldn't have reached there anyway, but now I can. I see. I can't bring it back. Flip trap door. Crawl. Oh, you crawl the exit? I refuse. I will get on the trap door. What's in here? What's in here? What's in this stupid room? What is in this stupid room? Honey. Chest. And I see the barrel. I'm not blind. I see the barrel. Not to brag. But I saw it probably before you did. Ken, is, Ken trying his best not to be blind because he's in denial. I'm so good at seeing. What is this be placed on? Dark oak planks. I remember where dark oak planks are because I can see. Okay. Look, look, look at me. Look at me looking. Wait, can you even exit here? You can't. What do I do now? <gasps> Saw the barrel. Saw the barrel. Saw the barrel. World record most barrels seen in an hour. Man, man sees most barrels. Any percent look at barrel speedrun. I've seen so many barrels. Okay, we just need one more Pride and Prong. And I'll, I will bet with my... um. Elite seeing ability, my high seeing IQ, I'll probably find it right away. I'll probably find it very quickly. I bet I'll find it in like the next, maybe even minute, you know? Don't want to be that crazy. But look. Look. I bet I'll see it in the next 30 seconds. Boom. 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 The power of sight. The gods have blessed me. You tore down the walls. Yes. Anyway, I will start writing the file size limit for this transmission, so I hope that I'm coming. <laughs> the file size limit? <gasps> Let's go! He reached the file size limit, he can't speak anymore. Oh my gosh. Chat. Chat. I am a world champion. I have won multiple championships in 50 countries for the ability to see barrels, and you will not believe it. But I see a barrel on my screen. I see a barrel. That's how good I am. That's what the best in the world can do. The best barrel seer sees all barrels. I'm gonna go get it. I'm gonna go get that barrel. Actually, there's probably an easier way. There's gotta be another way. 
No, it's this way. There's a barrel. It's gonna have something. Let's go! We found every secret! <laughs> every secret! With the power of sight, I used F5! I used F5! <laughs> I was able to see a barrel I couldn't have seen before! I'm... I'm... See what? See what gaming is off brand me. He's off brand me. I'm the OG seer. Oh my gosh. Dude, I got the full drip. Uh now we still need that emerald. Wait, don't tell me I missed a barrel. Wait, wait a minute. Barrel! I'm like, oh, oh my god, this is literally like PewDiePie. <laughs> Old PewDiePie. I got the barrel. I saw the barrel! I see all barrels. <sighs> barrel. <laughs> Wait, where's the villager? I think he's over here. Hey. We get the riptide. Let's go craft our trident. Oh, I'm so good at seeing barrels. Okay, no barrels there. Sorry, just as, as a supreme barrel seer, I just have to check. Okay. Wait. Oh, I, I probably have to legit craft it. Hey. And then... Oh, and then we anvil it. Now, I'll be completely honest. I'm pretty sure you cannot make this shot with a trident from here maybe from there maybe from there but i don't think so because it's riptide 2 and i've messed with riptide 2 i don't think it goes far enough that was close wait okay look my skill my my skills my skills reside in looking at barrels not in throwing tridents <clears throat> What? Huh? Angle it. We are trying to determine the status of Canadians' eyesight. We are implementing a Canadian blind. Okay. Okay. I don't want to hear Canadian blind. I'm going to ban that word. Someone says angle it, but with an I. I angled it. Didn't work. Bad advice. Bad advice. No angle works. This doesn't work. Do you think the other hope pit works better? <gasps> okay, it does work. Single least practical way to cross that gap. A flying a trident? Wasn't there, Wasn't there a portal to the other behind? side? Okay. Okay. Flip every trap door. Flip every trap door. Flip every trap door. Hmm, okay, so apparently you can pick up berries. I'm pretty sure you can't do that in regular adventure mode. Actually, I'm not that sure. But I didn't think so. If so, that's kind of scuffed. I don't know. Just being able to break something and not knowing. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm not. I'm not actually gonna flip every trap door. I can see. I can see what's on the other side of them. What's in the house? Three iron blocks can be placed on stripped dark oak log. Right. Remember that order. And lapis. We're gonna enchant something. <gasps> oh. Oh, this is going to be a code. Another code. 264. Yeah, okay. This isn't good. Oh, I hope the code isn't something stupid. And there's barriers. Guys, can we get an can we get an L barrier in chat for bad for bad map design? Placing barriers on some of the doors. 
I swear. Hey guys, can we get L barrier times two? Watching this at 3 a.m. instead of sleeping for school. That's that's a good idea. That's a better idea. This is good for your IQ. Watching me play makes you smarter. <laughs> okay. Guys, it's a barrel. It's actually three barrels. And they're all locked. And then we flip every trap door. And then we check this. A barrel re resides in this house. That's a true statement. That is correct. I can confirm. As a professional, I can confirm. Only reachable from the top of the interior. From the top of the interior? I see no such barrel. Hmm, you'd think an expert barrel seer would see a barrel in here, but I don't see a barrel. I don't know how much we can trust your credibility, sir. Unless. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, this is good. This is good. This is good. Oh, you gotta flip that. That's nice. That's actually kind of a nice, like, logic puzzle. I like a good logic puzzle. That isn't just... Know how our funky mechanics work. Where you can pause time. And that's cool. But when it's just an individual... I like, I like that this is just straight-up logic. Of... Well, kind of. It's not the best example. But, like... Figuring out... Wait. Oh, you just have to jump. Oh, it's just going to be a bit tricky. Because you have to jump. Okay, I see. I see what to do. Or I see what I think you have to do. Hmm. Could be wrong. There are many universes where I'm wrong. We're not in one of them. I only like to reside in universes where I'm right. That's not a good. Me that's not a good state of mind. I see all caps in chat. That worries me. They're about to say something like, "You missed a barrel," and you say you have good eyesight. What do you mean? Did I miss something? Did I miss something? You should try jumping. How are you missing the barrel? How are you? What barrel? What barrel? This one? Guys, I've already opened this. What? Please tell me you were not talking about this barrel. There's no barrels up here. There's probably It's probably hidden in the corner. It's hidden under a trap door. Or... There it is. There it is. There it is. I think you can... I think you can um, be quiet now. Because clearly I'm the expert. I know what I'm doing. What does this do? You fluid falling feather. Fluid falling feather? Fluid falling feathers? Infused with the power to decrease one's falling speed when, incre when in the right hands. Oh, slow falling feather. There was a campfire under some trap doors. Can you, can, can, can. Wait, really? There was a campfire under the trap doors? Are you sure? No, under the barrel you just tried to open. Under the barrel you just tried to... You are not talking about this barrel. We're not talking about any of these barrels. I checked these all the second I walked in here. Okay. Unless, unless you get some empirical proof that there was a campfire in there, I'm ignoring you. What's in here? No, it's a builder. I wasn't sure where you wanted me to hide that helmet, so I just put it behind the door. <laughs> okay. Okay. This map just hides too many barrels. It's just hiding things outside. Campfire outside. Me and the boys looking for campfire outside. Oh, right here. I don't even get anything from it. <laughs> I honestly forgot you could break campfires, though. Maybe I should be looking for birch planks, too. Anyway, uh, right, this room. We were just in here. We checked the barrel. We got iron helmet with no special properties. Hmm. 
Okay. Um. You think you just put sweet berries in here? Nice. Nice. Epic. You think this is enough? By by Minecraft logic? Campfires don't have to be lit. There are unlit ones. <laughs> Everyone's spamming blind. Everyone is spamming blind to the most eye-competent person. The most eye-trained person in the world. Okay, give me a house. Guys, guys. One through five. One through five. Give me a house. One, two, three, four, five. Say the number. If you guys say different numbers, I'm not listening to you. You guys all have to say the same number. Which one? One, two, three, four, five. Which one has the campfire in it? If I see two different numbers, I'm ignoring you. Okay, one guy says five. You're wrong. This one's blocked. You're wrong. All right, I'm not listening to you anymore. Yo! We grew a big tree with one bone meal. Okay. Uh. Oh, okay. We can get out. We can get out. Okay, everyone's saying five. Everyone is saying five. You're so wrong. You're just outside. Okay. All right, let's look for your unlit. Guys. 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 I swear, we tried this like an hour ago. All right, all right, look. Well, I think we can both take an L here. All right, a little bit. I will admit, when I came over here and mined this, I'll be honest, as a professional at looking at barrels, not campfires, I didn't see these. You're right. But you know what? I did something a little better than seeing campfires. You know what I did? I used my brain. You see, when I mined the campfire, and I found that I picked up zero items. What? Oh. I inferred, I inferred that maybe campfires don't drop anything on this island. And so, considering you didn't make that an inference, why, why are you talking about a device on my computer? What are you talking about? Stop, I'm trying to stream. Okay, anyway. Everyone's like, I used F5. You guys just need to use your brains. Okay, let's see if there's a hidden barrel in this tree. Ah, the tree's actually bigger on the inside. We call it the unaffiliated... What? I don't even look for this joke on the island. I don't think the tree was that big. Wait, you can see every time I teleport. You can see the world clip every time I teleport. Outside world? Inside world. Oh, that is very convincing. That is very convincing. Tiny tree. Tiny world. Big tree on the inside. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Okay. So. We got a ladder that goes up somewhere. Hmm. Hmm. I remember this. I'll be honest, I placed those without thinking about what they probably even do. I don't know why I placed those. Those don't do anything. That doesn't make any sense. Canadian the Capboy. You owe us 1,300 players according to the Randomizer Skyblock World Border server. What? Scaffolding and house too. What are you talking about? What do you mean? What do you mean? I can't break scaffolding. Gaslighting is our thing. You know what? After this one person in chat said, gaslighting is our thing, I'm not listening to anything you say anymore. After that, I don't trust anything. <laughs> You've lost me. <laughs> You've lost me with that one line. Everything I hear you say, I will now assume is gaslighting. Okay. 
Guys, I think this enchanting table... I think there's something wrong with my enchanting table. I think there's something's wrong with it. You can still use it, though. Should we enchant the trident with something more? Enchant the axe, perhaps? The hoe? The helmet. Ah. Magnetism. Hmm. I don't remember magnetism being part of the Minecraft. Breaking news. New stops reading chat. I just got called new. I guess we'll enchant it. It refuses to go into this top bar slot. I put it here. It re it, anyway. So let's just really quickly check every single trap door in the entire room because there's an a thousand percent chance one of these has a hidden barrel behind it. I will check F5. Look. We found something. That is proof. That is confirmation. That is positive reinforcement of my dogma that this map hides too many things behind trap doors. Most of them consisting of barrels. Trap door. Trap door. Trap door. Can someone behind one of these trapdoors tell me what use magnetism does for a helmet? I just, I need someone somewhere in the world to, to give me the insight as to why the heck I want a magnetic helmet. I don't know how many times I flipped some of these trapdoors. I probably flipped them several times. And that's good. That's a good thing. Always be flipping your trapdoors. There's one up on these ladders. Wait, what if we wear the helmet? Do we... Maybe if we use the feather fog? Hmm, I'm not sticking to it. I'll be, I'll be real. Not really sticking. In the meantime, I will check some more of these trap doors. Maybe there's one piece of the puzzle we're missing. Dude, I can't trust this map. It hides too many things in trapdoors. <gasps> oh, it's just another one of like the Easter eggs. We found we found all the Easter eggs that matter, so I don't even care. Flip those trapdoors. Guys, I promise you, if you saw a barrel, you're lying. I don't want to hear anyone talking about seeing a barrel. Oh. And we found one more Easter egg head. That was probably all of them. So. Huh. What are you guys saying? YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain smooth strength. YouTube, what are you doing? What's wrong? Break birch planks. There is one under the trap door. Break birch planks. Break birch planks. Break birch planks. Oh, oh, you mean you mean these birch planks? You mean these birch planks? There is no birch planks. There is no birch planks. This is 1984. Forget what you saw. There is no birch plank. There actually isn't. Unironically. You've been gaslit. There's no birch planks. You thought there were birch planks. L. L. Look how dumb you look. I swear there's one birch planks. I checked everything. I checked everything. Guys. This doesn't break oak wood. It breaks birch planks. I can't break the wood. <sighs> okay. The log left to the enchanting table is a map with a log texture. What are you guys? Why am I listening to you? I told I said I wouldn't listen to you anymore. You might be thinking that because the texture of the enchanting table is a bit weird, because of how it, they generated it to look so big. But there's no trend. I'm gonna stop listening to you. I've been trying to figure out how to get this eyepiece, and you guys are just trying to figure out how to 
Guys, it's the IP. I don't even need an eyepiece. I don't even need an eyepiece. I can already see perfectly. Go to the second house scaffolding. You know what? Raptorn. Raptorn. I will look in the second house with the scaffolding. Every half half the chat, half the chat is saying, hey, maybe try doing this jump with the feather falling, and maybe you'll like magnetize or something. Half the chat is saying that. One person in chat is saying do a flip. One person in chat is saying one person in chat, Raptorn, is saying go to the second scaffolding. And you know what? Since you're so special, since you're so special, Raptorn, of all the people in chat telling me the right solution, I will listen to you. I will walk into the second house and I will look at the scaffolding. Now what do you want me to do, Raptorn? What are we doing, Raptorn? I see the scaffolding. Oh, all his messages got deleted. <laughs> he got he got timed out. All right, all right, let's go solve the puzzle. <laughs> I'm so sorry, dude. Wait, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it, Raptor. <laughs> it was it was all chill until you got muted, and now I feel bad. We're all good. We're all having fun. Okay. Fluid falling, fluid feather, fluid falling feather, magnetic helmet. Let's see how this goes. Oh, that's a developer only. Yo. Okay. All right. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Juggle. Go down the scaffolding. At least read the manual. I can't go down. Why am I listening? Why am I? Don't listen to chat. Don't listen to chat. Don't listen to them. All right. Anyway. Eyepiece. After purchase and delivery, the product is activated on hold. Users may experience a change in depth perception and previously unnoticeable traces of the color spectrum should not be visible. Standing on terracotta has been given has been reported to give unique traces, r r unique perspectives on these traces. It can lead to the perception of numbers. Bruh, that's the most troll thing. After installation, vaults are set to the default passcode blank. To enter the three digit passcode, right click and select a digit to, and use the buttons to cycle through. Okay, so, it's just, so this is just to get the passcode. See? Look at this, guys. My eyesight hasn't even changed. That's how good it is. I use the eyepiece and nothing happens because my eyesight is already perfect. Yeah. So, I'll just come back here because someone's saying crawl through the scaffolding. I think with, with the highest intensity of my thought process, I think this is what you're trying to say. Oh, what? Oh. What? Oh. Okay. I will admit I didn't see that. But also, I think that's the intended solution. <laughs> I think that's the, in I think that's actually the intended solution. <laughs> That's not how we did it. I did it the different way. I think you guys just found the way you're supposed to do it. That's how you're supposed to. I I just did it by like parkouring like that. That's how I did it. <laughs> but I mean Okay, I didn't I didn't see that. That's cool. Okay. Luck. Of all the things, of all the things I've mocked you for, I've screamed at for, made fun of people unjustly for, you did get one thing right, okay? You got the scout, you did see the scaffolding, I'll admit, and you did also see, you did also see these, I didn't even mind these. Yeah, we can't mind them. So, I've been humbled. I've been, I've been to the smallest degree, I'm only a little bit, only a little bit humbled. I'm not extreme levels of blindness, not extreme. I saw everything in the map except for one. I saw everything except for one thing. You cannot tell me I'm extremely blind. You can't tell me I'm extremely blind when I missed one thing. Okay, let's just get that out of the way. You can call me blind, fine, fine. Call me Canadian blind. Tell me I missed something, but I only missed one thing. Okay, definitely only one thing. Don't go back in the stream. Everything else I found. And also it didn't even matter. It didn't even matter. 
Because you know what? My eyesight is so good that I was able to see the alternate solution. Before I saw the intended one, I saw the alt I saw the more efficient way before I saw the less efficient way. Because I just think ahead. That's anyway. Let's use the eyepiece. Because perhaps Oh. Okay, so it does do something. Look guys, I am blind. I couldn't see I couldn't see these before. I couldn't see the terracotta before. Okay, what happens when you stand on it? What? Okay, that's actually pretty clever. I don't know how much I like that. Oh, kind of, but it's kind of... Hmm. Okay, I'm stuck on my opinion of this. This is interesting. Well, it's more efficient to do the intended way. Avatar, Avatar, I swear to the mother of whoever is the god of birds. What do you mean it's more efficient to do... Okay, forget it, forget it. We're not even solving the puzzle anymore. We're not even solving the puzzle anymore. We're not... You guys, you guys... I am sick of you talking about... Look at this. Look at this. You crouch here. You flip this trap door. You hold shift. You hold shift until you hold control. You just crawl all the way under here. You jump on this ladder. You jump on this ladder. And then you do this. That's the intended way. You know what my way is? You know what my way is? You crouch here. And then you just jump. Which way is more efficient, Avatar? Which way was more efficient, huh? What do you mean? What do you mean which one's more efficient? What do you mean you saw it first? I saw the six, guys. I saw... Shut up! I saw the six. Okay. Guys, I saw it. I sat here. Roll back in the chat. I looked at this. I went, man, I don't know how I think about this. And I was like, oh, okay. That's the solution. You have broken me. You've broken me. You've ripped me apart. Every little thing I do, I freak out about. Canadian named himself Canadian. When he isn't even Canadian, you can't trust him. You should clip the stream down to a 10 minute of highlights. No. The only reason, the only reason I didn't point out the six is because I looked in chat and saw Avatar talking about how the intended way is more efficient, but okay. And I had to go prove him wrong. And I did. And now I'm back and I see the six. I get it. I get it. I know how to do it. I know. How I don't need you to tell me. I don't need you to boss me around. You're not my parents. The actual video is going to be just chat versus Canadian. I'm, this isn't even going to be a video. You guys have destroyed me. All right. All right. Guys, 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 guys. Guys, I don't see it. Where's the number? Where's the number, chat? Where's the number? Do you think you can help me find it? I'm so blind. I'm sorry. I just... I can't see it. Sorry. I don't know what the number was. I don't know what it was. Okay, where was the other one? Right here. Okay. Oh no! Guys, where's the number? Is it over here? Is that where the number is? Is it in... Is it there? Is that the number? Where's the number, guys? Where? Where's the... I can't see the number. I can't see it. Ah, guys, I, I, we just can't solve this. We just can't solve... I'm just too blind. I can't... I can't make out a six. I guess... I guess we'll never be able to see the numbers. Let's just go back and wallow in shame. This is actually kind of a dumb jump, I'll be honest. One day. One of these days. Okay. You know what? Instead of trying to find instead of trying to figure out the numbers, honestly. How about we just guess, you know? Maybe we can just guess. Here. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is so dumb. This is so dumb. I give up. Ready? Use the... You have to press F5 to find the... 
<laughs> it's eight, by the way. Hello? Hello? Let's put the let's put the drip back on. It's going to keep lagging. I'm just going to close some tabs and see if that fixes things. Hello? Is it fine now? Some people say totally lag, some people say it's back. The way you found it is a trickier jump, so it takes longer to do it first try. Well, that's just because I'm bad. Oh no, the mic's muted. Oh no, the mic's muted. I hate you guys. I want you to know that. I want you to know that I hate you. I hate you. All of you guys in chat, I hate every one of you individually, personally. Skill issue. Don't worry, Ken, it's fine. No. No, I'm never talking to you any ever again. Everyone in chat right now, everyone who's currently watching this stream, who has chatted, you guys are all banned. I'm banning you from my chat. Next stream, all of you will be gone. I'll have no I'll have no one in chat because you're probably the only people. I have like two people, two new people who weren't on this stream. You're all banned. Except for except for Raptorn. Raptorn is not banned. <laughs> Rap Raptorn gets to stay because he pointed out the scaffolding everyone says unsub no you know I've been thinking about what I'm gonna call this map hey look I'll be I'll be honest I'm pretty sure I would have solved the map faster if I wasn't constantly paranoid about trap doors for one like the magnetism thing I mostly had the idea on what to do there but I was like so determined to like yell at everyone in chat <laughs> and just just go go to places and be like, look, you're wrong. See, there's no birch. Look, you're wrong. See, there's there's no map here. But yeah. Someone someone here has got 70 alternative accounts. <laughs> W Canadian, but what if I'm just a spectator? Yeah, no, you can still watch the stream. You're just all banned. <laughs> Have mercy, please. YouTubers, thank you so much. I love you guys. Meanwhile, Canadian, yeah. His dignity is in a barrel. He can't find it. Guys, you know, I don't know if you know this. There's a barrel in this. You know what you guys are? You're mansplainers. That's what you are. You're mansplaining the solution to me. Because I'm too busy explaining it to you. Ken, this stream was very entertaining and it made my night. Thank I'm glad. I'm glad. <laughs> you guys you guys need to No. Alright, I'm gonna stop being unnecessarily angry. Let's find the barrel in this room. There's a barrel somewhere. Crafting table. Is it behind the painting? You can actually break paintings in Adventure. They must have made a data pack, so you can't. Where's the barrel? There's a barrel somewhere in this room. There can't be zero barrels. There can't be zero barrels. There's the final room. They hid every stupid item in a barrel. There has to be one in this room. Hmm. Is there no barrels? No barrels? No barrels? Wait, this looks like a prototype of the ending lobby. Yo, you can slap this child in the face. That's funny. Look at it. You can just whack him. 
a little moron. Because he works for this group of people who hides things in barrels. There's no barrels in this room. As a professional barrel sealer, I can confirm. There's, there actually, there is, there is. There's a barrel, there's a barrel, there's a barrel. No, there's not. No, there's not. Okay, no barrels. I give up. There's no barrels in this room. Now let's go check Chad and they'll be like, you missed it. It's over there. You can still understand my, like, um, lack of trust, though. Because, <laughs> like, 50% of the time you guys were hitting L's. So every time someone said something like scaffolding, I was like, type E if you see the barrel. <laughs> wow. Man just said the barrel. I'm going to... I'm going to get an x-ray client just to prove you wrong. Just to prove there isn't a barrel. There's no barrel. There's really no barrel. I see the campfire. I see the campfire. I don't see the barrel. Because there is no barrel. There actually is no barrel. There's no barrel. Why am I trusting you guys? There's no barrel. I already know there's no barrel. I already checked. I don't have to check again. I already know I'm right. But maybe I'm wrong. I'm not wrong. I'm not wrong. I'm not wrong. Okay. Oh, and then this exit room just attaches. Cool. Cool. Okay. Hmm. There's some additional credits. Oh, they're gone now. So sad. And let's get the stats. I don't care about the stats. How do we get back? How do we exit? How do we go back to spawn? I, I, we do got to admit, I did find all the secrets. <laughs> Pretty good. Pretty good. Found all the secrets. There's nothing behind the painting. You can't even break the painting. Unless you're in creative, like so. Nothing there. No barrels. I don't believe you. There's no barrels. There's no barrels here. Yeah. Um, what do we do now? Should we speed run it? By the way, go into creative mode and destroy the map. You should do an escape room IRL. I've actually only done one ever. We didn't make it in time. I'm bad at IRL speedruns. Speed runs what? Uh, escape rooms. Ah. My brain is lagging faster than this stream. I'm back, if you say so. Try beating the world record of 9-11. The record's actually 9-11. That's, why would I want to break that? That's such a good record. That's such a, I don't even want to mess with that. That's great. Great record. I can try doing it a little faster, just to kind of get an idea of how long it would take to run. You can play the map again though, right? You just have to... Do I need to upload a fresh version of the map? Is there no play it again? Oh, it tells me how long I was on each level. 18 deaths. Oh. Slay Otter Enjoyer? Can you should kick your family out of the house? A oh, YouTuber having a family? Yeah. People are leaving? Yeah, I don't care if people are leaving. I'm gonna go finish school stuff, so maybe give Wolf Mod okay, bye. 
Okay. Congrats, Wolf. You're now moderator. And now... Dude, I've just lost all my energy. I spent way too much time screeching. Half the viewers left, so we should do another room. I'm not going to do another room, because I'm pretty sure they're all broken. Which is what I'm worried about. Um, because people have playtested some of them and said they couldn't even get them to work. So I don't know. I don't even know how we're going to get the video to work. And I don't want to just play adventure maps like this, because this isn't, this doesn't qualify as escape room, I don't think. It's, it's just an adventure map. Minecraft, but if I lose the escape room, I have to touch grass. Half the viewers left. Yes, I get it. Are you doing another map? Do you really want to do another map? I will honestly just download the second map on the list. And we'll see what it is. It's by a user named Cat. It's in Java Edition 1.19. We can just we straight up just play it, but I, it probably won't be good. What do you think? Do you want to play some random map some random kid made uh, six months ago? Escape Dale's Labyrinth on stream, yes. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Everyone says yes. Do number 15. Do another map. That's what we came here for. Yeah, well, I only wanted to play the one. <laughs> okay, so here's the problem with playing another map. Right? Um, the, down the estimated download time is 15 minutes. <laughs> and it's 23 megabytes which isn't even a lot that doesn't make any sense Yo, let me know when we're back from awful lag. This is the last one we're going to play, by the way. We just want to play one more, and I want to show you how bad these are and why we're not going to play more. Open up the world border, sir. Nah. That world is broken. In content creating, you should make money. Yeah, I'll make money later. People say we're back. Ken, Ken should do a high pixel stream with chat stream sniping him. No. I hate these people. I don't want them stream sniping me. I should stop saying that. I really don't. We had a good time. That was very fun. I hope Ken plays my prison. Captain Zap, you're the one who made a prison on Bedrock Edition, right? We're back. We're back. Okay, look. This is the second one on the list. I just picked number two on the list. It's probably no one on streams one. It's just literally went down some random kid named Cat. The prison is named Prison Yes for Canadian. We're just going to go in. 
if it's good, if it works out, like it's actually a quality map, somehow, like it works, as long as it just works, then I will, I'll play another. If it's completely broken, we'll call it there because I assume most of them are broken. I feel like it'll be like this. We'll just use this one as a case study. Oh my gosh, this map is so broken. We're not even inside it. Bro, he just finished, he just finished building it. I don't even know where the entrance is. Okay, see? See how broken these are? I don't even know where to start. Okay, wait. Do you think that's the start? Or is this the start? This might be the start. Don't make it into slabs. Trust me. Jeez. Oh, here's her. Here's where we start. Okay. Let's start. Cool. Map dev. Don't make into slabs. Trust me. Hmm. Okay. We got seven oak planks. Hmm. Guys, do you think we should craft seven oak planks into a slab? Do you think we should make a slab with these oak planks? Ah, uh, let's make a slab so we can escape. Actually, you know what you can't? You know what? I wonder if the intended solution is trap doors or boat. Because either works, and obviously a boat's better. But I wonder if the map creator thinks. I bet it's probably a boat. I bet they intended it to be a boat. But yeah, anyway, we're going to do this the safe way. And check the next hopper. Bro! Ah! Uh, why? Why is there an ender pearl? Chat. <laughs> oh no. I already give up on this map. I already give up. Oh no. Yeah, we gotta take this. It, guys, it doesn't matter. We already have an ender pearl and a boat. Is it is the solution gonna be ender pearl over the gap? Bruh. It's gonna be ender pearl over and then place the boat under. How thick are the walls? Maybe the walls are thick so you can't throw an ender pearl. You know? Maybe they maybe they accounted for this. No, they did not account for this. We can we can escape with the ender and with the ender pearl. We can escape with the ender pearl. Let's go. I told you. I told you the maps were going to be broken, and look what happened. Look what happened. All the maps are just super... I mean, that's what they're supposed to be. They're supposed to be broken. Because that's what makes it entertaining. But after a while, I feel like it's just going to get repetitive. All right, let's do it the intended way. Let's do it the intended way. I'll give myself an ender pearl back, and we'll pretend that didn't happen. That never happened, guys. We'd never escaped. All right. Okay, so. See, I told you these maps are too broken. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go. That never happened. That didn't happen. This is so stupid. Okay, I'm actually gonna fail this ender pearl shot. I'm, I'm like most likely gonna fail it, which is funny. Oh! Oh! Oh, I made it perfectly through the gap. Never mind. Okay, well, let's see what this room's all about. Yeah, okay, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. So. We got a sign that says, yes, it's a hopper. It must always be a hopper. Okay. So to get there, um, I do believe that you can do this. Okay, I don't know if that's intended, but that's how I'm going to get up. What's in the hopper? A lever. Okay. What, do I put the lever there? Is that it? 
I just realized I skipped the room. Like, I unironically completely skipped a room. I don't care, though. Like, I, I remember what room it is. I saw a room. There's a hallway we didn't go down. It doesn't even matter. It literally doesn't matter that we forgot a room. We can still escape this without that room. What? Is the redstone broken? Okay, since I already escaped three times, I think I have a right to check if the redstone's broken. Oh, never mind, never mind. I'm just blind. I will admit I'm blind on that one. I don't know how we're supposed to get up there. We could just mine me. This is so dumb. I'm just gonna save time. What do we do? What do we even do here? What are we doing? You did not need to place that second plank. Yes, I did. Look, I can reach here, but not when I break the boat. Then I can't reach there anymore. Chat trying to lecture the smartest Minecraft player in the world. Don't forget the hopper. Yeah, we checked the hopper. Why didn't you break the carafting table in the first year? Because I didn't care. I literally don't even care. It's you want. Should we go back? Should we go back to the first room, or should I just pretend I spent five minutes breaking those and move on? Let's pretend I broke those. Okay. Okay. We're in the next room. We're in the next room. We don't even need the crafting table. We don't need it. Okay. Cool. There's lava. Guess what? Oh my gosh. Wait. How long does this lava go for? Hmm, something hidden in the hot, that lava. I have a parkour map on education edition, want to try it? I don't have education edition. There's nothing here. Okay. Oh boy, there's a hopper, guys. Two iron. Should we check under the hopper? I'm just gonna save time. Nothing under the hopper. What is this escape room? It's like it's like an AI designed this. I think an AI designed this escape room and just put random things from alms maps. Random hoppers, random lava. None of it makes sense. Maybe we should go check the other room. I honestly kind of want to see what the intended solution was. If we didn't already escape. So, if we didn't, imagine we don't have any of these items. Except the boat. We do have the boat. And I'll use the boat to do this, just because it's a little safer. So what would we have done? We'd walk over here. We get flint. Uh, we'd also check under the lava. We'd see there's nothing under the lava. Okay. We'd check under this hopper. Oh, yeah, and of course we'd get this crafting table. Look, I know I can use the boat. I just, I'm just trying to get a sense of all the items we'd have. So imagine we had all those items. And then you're in here. I don't get it. Flint and steel seems like the obvious thing, obviously. That doesn't do anything. I just want to know what the intended solution is. We already escaped. I just want to know like what you're supposed to do. So you come in here, you're probably supposed to just go in there and come out. Oh, oh, I kind of get the idea. I get the idea. We have to go through this. I forgot that exists. So maybe the idea is you set yourself on fire and you kind of bounce up all of these levels. So I'm thinking this is, this is what I'm envisioning. So you gotta set yourself on fire. You know, this is a lot easier on a server. It doesn't even matter. We can use the boat, but anyway. 
Or no, 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 wait. You know what makes even more sense? If instead we place the block here, set ourselves on a fire. Oh, this is hard. That's hard. I'm just going to do it this way. <laughs> Wait, I can't even place it. What? Okay, there we go. Yeah. In fact, now that I think about it, I could go one block even higher than that. It doesn't matter, though. But, yeah. I could have... Yeah. 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 Also, wait, wait. New idea here. New idea. Yeah. Didn't even have to do tricky parkour there. Okay. Now, we'll do this again. And this is where it gets a little impossible-ish. But not completely. Okay, we soft-locked. The end. Goodbye. <laughs> Actually, we haven't even soft-locked. We technically get up at the crafting table. This would just be really hard. Oh, this would be super hot. I'm not doing this. Okay, we're back. Canadian cheats. Canadian fakes his videos. Real. Canadian fakes his way up to here. We're just checking. We're just trying to see what the intended solution is. It's not cheating if I already escaped, okay? It's just... It's just looking around. That's all we're doing. Just... We're just seeing the map. We're not playing it. Alright, I'm giga confused now. I thought there was going to be something in here. Oh, you're supposed to pick up the lava. You can't pick up the lava. We only have one iron. You think I missed something and you can actually get more iron somewhere? Because yeah, I guess the solution, you know, obviously it would be another portal, but... I don't want to check that just because I know there's not, not going to be anything hidden behind it. We may have somehow forgotten, like, we may have missed a bucket. Oh! Oh! Bro. Yep, that's the map. You're supposed to use the bucket, pick up eight of the lava, not destroy the lava from earlier. You're supposed to magically know that's the solution beforehand. Probably because you get the flint earlier. Oh, well, I'm not complaining. I already escaped it three times, so. Yeah. Do you want to do another? Be be honest with yourselves. Do we want to play another map? I want you to be brutally, cynically honest. Your choice. Do we go left? Where we stop stream and go to bed because it's, like, late? Or, uh, unless you're, like, Asian. And, or do we go right and play another? The solution was a hopper. I don't even know at this point. Yeah. Yeah, it literally was a hopper. That's this whole map. That's this whole map. I thought I was so smug throwing a pearl, but little did I know. Everyone says yes. Oh my gosh. Everyone says yes. I love watching you destroy moments. Okay. I'll go download the next one. I will download literally the next on the list. Let me check the list. Uh, that's the Wii Remix. Ah, uh, that's... Okay, where is it? Where is it? Uh, shoot. I lost. I lost it. It's going to lag. I bet it's about to lag. When I download the map, it's going to lag. Oh, guys. The next map is by Terra Gaming. 
I kind of wanted to play this on on my own because I figured it might be a good one. It's called The Grand Torch. It's going to be a good one. I guess we'll play it on stream. We might as well. The Grand Torch. Minecraft's most secure torch. The most secure torch in all of Minecraft. Any moment now, it's going to like start buffering as I download it. Okay. I found it. About to download it. Rest in peace, internet. Say goodbye to the internet. Say hello to lag. No lag yet? No lag? Oh, wow. No lag, guys. I, you know, people have played the Grand Torch. I've heard great things about it. I've heard only great things about the Grand Torch. <sighs> uh, let's see what the Grand Torch is like. Wait, did I fully download it yet? Oh, Canadian Escape Room Challenge. I guess it's this one. Um, it's taking a while to load. Oh, look, very fancy. Buildy boy, cool, lovely. Hey, gotta give it points. At least it started, like, in the start area. <laughs> Instead of just after you finish building. Probably should take all the torches with you. Okay. Saturation. I would like saturation. Alright. Let's play. Um, Command block out. Put us on not on. So. Cool. Hmm. Yeah. Check the first room. Ooh. -woo. I would assume this is the first room. Okay, let's go pick up all the obvious things. Lodestone compass. Oh, that's kind of cool. Is it going to tell us where to go? In the map? That doesn't really work. But maybe it's helpful somehow. I'll use a whole new perspective real quick. And then, of course, you don't have to tell me. I know I'm going to break the torches. I was going to break them. You don't have to mansplain to me again. Like you did 20 minutes ago. Let's break the sign, too. I wonder what we need all the torches for. Shoot, I broke one. If we need every single torch, I have, I have five minutes to escape. Um, okay, what am I missing? F5, holding perspective. Able to see that I can't use F5 glitch because of these. Okay. Okay. Let's think you went to escape room school for this. You got this. You got this, Ken. Yeah, let's just check chat. Maybe they'll tell you the answer. Room first, not first room. That's a bedrock box. F3B. You can do F3 and B for hitbox. Yes, I know. Everyone's saying F3 and B for hitbox. Guys, there's no more stuff in here. I checked them all. No hitboxes. Except for that one. Which I'm freaking out about now. Next. Can't reach that. Can't place blocks. None of these are fake blocks. None of these are breakable. However, there are corners here. There are corners that are very notable. One of them's ought to have something. Because there are only two corners that are like this, that have this property. Let's actually keep F3B on just in case. I literally had F3B on at the beginning of the stream, and there's still people telling me to use it. Hmm. Yeah, I probably can't get that angle. Hmm. No, I hid an item frame with, like, a dark glass pane in it or something
Can I chat? What is it? Someone's saying not the torch. Ah. Press Alt F4 for extended. F4 plus Alt. Oh. Clever. Someone's just checked the barrel. That's. That's a take. Huh. Can't tell if I'm the dumb one. If everyone else isn't solving this, then maybe I'm not so dumb. Check the barrel, check the torch. I can't get the torch, guys. Let's calm down. Let's just calm. Let's just be very calm and not freak out about the fact that I've broken two torches. We will stay calm and methodical and think about this. And try and see if maybe there's a hidden item. This doesn't make any sense. Hmm. Hmm. Hold F three C and wait for ten seconds. That's a brilliant idea. That'll give us. That'll give us even better than F five. I've honestly started watching you since you first gave me the blah blah blah. I love your content. Cool. You didn't say there were two. Yeah, there is two. Press the G button. Oh, so I can open my X-ray client. Um. Hmm. Is this actually solvable? Check entity count. Yeah. Well, it's. Yeah. No, I don't think we're making it out of here in five minutes. I don't know what's wrong with me, but. Wait, I just considered what the solution may be. More thoroughly, I have an idea. I have an idea. I promise you. There's a trick I've done before where you use a, a blast furnace instead of bedrock. But every block seems to be real bedrock. Hmm. Well, the lodestone is pointing here. I see it. I see the lodestone. Hmm. I suppose we break it then. Dang. Okay, that was pretty, pretty clever. You can only see one pixel of it. How long does it take to break a lodestone, by the way? Oh, it doesn't take long. Okay. Lodestone broken. Did an item drop? Or... We can now see through this. Okay, we finally interacted with something. And yet... I don't know where that takes us. What's in there? Bedrock. 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 Huh. What does that do? Oh, do you think the lodestone wasn't even part of the puzzle? Do you think you just it's just there to point? Place torches on all the bedrock walls. I'm going to keep saying this until you try it. You think you think they coded it so if you place torches. Terra, I promise you Terra Gaming did not code it so that detects 
and trigger something. Hmm. Um. Yeah, I don't know what the point of breaking that lodestone was. Oh, look, the torches are gone. Anyway, the compass, where does the compass point now? Uh, it points nowhere because I broke its lodestone. Um, hmm. What? Trying to get an optimal F5 angle. He's F5. I am. Please just try placing the torch. I s Okay, fine, fine. Please, 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 please. Please, 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 please. Please, 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 please. Hope you're happy. They are now all torched up. Oh, please, please. Please. Hmm. That's that's kind of the spectrum. The problem with player made maps, what it's gonna be is every map is gonna be either way too far on the side of oops, everything breaks and there's fifty ways to escape, and then the other side where there are sometimes where people assume puzzles are intuitive because they know the solution and they're not. Cause like if it's something like if you've got to stand in a certain corner for a while and then like the cake one I made that's an example of one that no one would realistically ever be able to solve my cake escape room that's like this hmm. so we're gonna half of these we find are gonna be um, like the first one we saw and half of them are gonna be like this is what I mean check the two block hole And it's either because it's a really obscure solution or the map is actually broken and we have no way to know. Put all torches in the corner holes. That You think you think it's gonna be like there's an observer I can't see. I oh, yeah, these are the only corner holes I can place them in. Oh, wait. Actually, I didn't thoroughly check that corner because yeah, we've seen... Yeah. It's so hard to see. Wait, wait. I'm looking at the top edges of the room. Huh. Okay. Put F of V on 30 so you can see closer. Nah. Turn on subtitles. I saw wrong in there. Or is there a stone button in the room of the torches? No, there isn't a button in the torch. Oh, you mean this room? All the... Spots are occupied. There couldn't be a button here. And these spots are occupied, so there obviously can't be buttons here. I'll turn on subtitles. 
We're not going to get anything out of it. My F5 camera doesn't even fit in there. It literally doesn't even fit. Use your brain. Bedrock parkour. Give up. You can't parkour on the bedrock. That would be cool, but yeah, no. Unless there's a glitch. That I don't know. I don't think there is. Can someone go get Terra Gaming? I swear to God, just go in a spectator. The point of this map is weird. At this point, the map is weird. Yeah, again, this is one of the ones where people have said that no one was even able to... Like, this is one of the broken ones. As I've been told. Do you want to just... See? That's what I mean. That's exactly what I mean. That's what I mean. I literally said a moment ago, exactly what I said is people will make the solution something in unintuitive. Something that you have no way to know. And they'll, and they'll assume it's intuitive because they know the solution. You can listen to me word for word. That's exactly what I said. Half the maps, several escapes. Half the maps, almost impossible. In case you haven't figured it out, uh, apparently the lodestone is supposed to point in this corner to hint to you that you do this. That's the solution. That was it. That was it, guys. No way on earth we would have known. Even F3A wouldn't have told us. Whatever. We'll keep going. But yeah, that's the problem with some of these. <sighs> yeah, we can't get the item frame back. Huh? Bro, wait, no, there's multiple ender pearls? No! Okay. If there's more ender pearls in here, that's going to prove my point times two. Okay, never mind. There isn't. All right. Never mind. Let's go. We'll keep playing this map. I hope it just doesn't break again. All right. Now we're in this room. Brilliant. Cool. I wonder what to do. Um... Hmm. Oh, yeah. Ender Pearl. 64 charcoal. And a crafting table. And a bottle. And some armor. And, oh, guys, do you think maybe we'll brew something? Do you think maybe with gunpowder and a bottle we'll... Okay. Crafting table. You can't craft... Hmm, so there's not really a way up. Did it really intend for me to throw the pearl up to that room? Because if so... F for the two dead torches. Yeah, it's fine. Oh no, there's an item. There's an item. Up on that. There's a slab. Ah! It's still not enough. Oh, I see. Really? That was it? Okay, it's not bad. At least we know what the solution is now. How long does it last? Oh boy, this better not be... Oh, oh, if we fail this, we never get to do it again. Yep. This isn't going to work. Oh, no, I have... Okay, I have more time than I thought. Never mind. <sighs> yes, parkour that if you fail, you soft lock. This is a brilliant inclusion. I'm just going to keep doing... I don't think you... I, can, I don't think you can even do this jump. You probably need the crafting table. 
in which case there's no indication. Okay, it is possible, just barely. I'm not mining through all these cobwebs. Smelt armor, then make lanterns. Huh? What on earth? Oh, we're probably going to find out later that we need to make lanterns or something. Oh, maybe the original solution was to use... I don't know. Does it... It's probably broken. I bet you were supposed to make a lantern even though you don't need it. Yeah, we can't. We need blaze powder. Do you think there's blaze powder and we just missed it? I bet it's under the lava. How much you want to guess it's under the lava? Okay, it's not. Just had to check. Okay, I'm just going to break these. Because I'm not going to sit here and waste time. What is the point? <laughs> Why? Why? Huh? What? Is this actually just to waste your time? Are you supposed to use this? Like, get craft a sword? What? It, or is this to slow you down? Okay, back to normal. Oh boy, we have chains. Oh, but we can't jump because we don't have the jump boost anymore. Maybe we can use these item frames to elevate an item into some convenient... Okay. What's in there? Water. Cool. Yeah, maybe we did need that lantern, guys, so we can get up there. What's the point? Oh, I think the cobwebs are just to slow you down so you don't have jump boost by that point. You don't need that many cobwebs. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. What do we do? What do we do, champ? I give up. I give up. What do we do? You have a hatter fan. I got blaze powder in the one I downloaded in the room. In the first room. You got blaze powder in the first room. Charcoal blocks. Brilliant idea. Ken just did the classic techno hat. I always do that. This is part of my vocabulary. Do you drink potion? This is so dumb. Yes, this is so dumb. Someone says they got blaze powder in the first room in when they played. Did I miss hidden blaze powder? Um... Yeah, I don't see any. Unless I'm in the second room. Hmm. Would you have string if you broke the webs by hand? No. No, you'd need a sword to get string. Charcoal blocks lol. Yeah! Let's do it. Let's make charcoal blocks. Do you think you're actually supposed to make a lantern? Drink water and stay hydrated. Yeah. Okay. Here. I'm just going to throw all these items out and get a lantern. And it still won't change anything. Let's throw out the charcoal, too. Who needs it? Look, we crafted a lantern. Okay, back to the future. Where we're all the way over here. And now, we have a block and a lantern. I get the lantern back up. I don't know what I was expecting to do there. The lantern was probably for the earlier section. Maybe, oh, maybe you're supposed to use a lant. Okay, maybe the solution was you'd place the lantern in the earlier section. And then, like, somehow. And then you would have picked up the slab and then picked up the lantern with it. And, I don't know.
break the chains. Someone says break the chains. What for? What? You just want to sit here and break the chains? You can't pick them up. Where's the hidden blaze powder? I just want to know where the hidden blaze powder is. You know it's not in here. Bro, this is killing my vibe. That's wiggity whack, yo. Or shears to get the cobweb. Yeah, we don't have enough to make shears. Make chains and charcoal block. Yeah, you actually don't have enough for chains either. With the iron we would have gotten. Do you want to just see what the next room is? E. It's E room. You know, I made a map like a year and a half ago before escape rooms ever were a thing. That was basically the same style. It's called string theory. It was literally my original escape before even Siwa Gaming. Like I was in the game before Siwa Gaming, who started the game, which is typical of me. Uh, no, I'm kidding. But uh, anyway, um, okay, do cobweb clutch. Okay, whatever. Um, and the idea was that you could look at the map in spectator because you weren't supposed to be able to figure out all the tricks and all the rooms first try. You were supposed to just look at the map figure out the solution by looking at it and then be able to play through it to test. It was more of a puzzle box. I half advertised it as an escape room, half as a puzzle box. And that's, I kind of like that format better, which is kind of what I'm doing right now. Just seeing, okay, what would have been the solution? If we fly over here, where's, you know, uh, let's, instead of just hoping that we don't soft lock and don't forget a hidden item, the last map we did was good. The first map we played during the stream, obviously, because it's like a professional escape room, it tells you, obviously, you're missing something, but something made by a five-year-old, if you miss something, it's way, way too easy to soft lock. Eat the eye and damage boost. Eat the eye and damage boost. You can't eat spider eyes. Anyway, let's see this epic clutch. This is the safe way to do the clutch. To enter, you need to insert 45 torches. Brilliant, I have 60. Let me in. Oh, wait, exactly 45? Wait, do you think because there was too many, it stopped? Wait, it has to go through all of these hoppers? Wait. I think the redstone's broken, guys. I think the redstone's broken. <laughs> oh, and it's supposed to set you free. Canadian better than CWAC Gaming confirmed. Oh, yeah, that's always been true. The solution was a poison potion for the boost. Yeah, but I can't, but there's no blaze powder. Like, we couldn't find the blaze powder. You can eat spider eyes, just not when you have saturation. Oh, yeah, you're right. But I think the, the, well, I, I can't. I'm pretty sure I have infinite saturation. Yeah, I have infinite saturation, so that's not even the solution. Yep. Oh, every chat was a step ahead of me there. Okay. Do you want to just try and figure out what this would have been? Let's assume we played everything perfectly. Obviously, can't get the furnace. Nothing hidden under the lava. Okay, so we would have been in this room. With the jump boost 2 potion. Which was taken directly from the creative inventory. And you have a crafting table. Let's assume we had the lantern. Because that's the best block you can get. With that. And you would have had the slab. Um, and. Hmm. How do you get. How do you get two blocks. Wait, someone said in the web clutch column or something? Oh. 
Actually, let me check the web clutch column because we kind of skimmed over it. Maybe there's, maybe there's a hidden item in here. No, we, that wouldn't have been helpful. Yeah, it doesn't matter what's in the later set. We just, yeah, we need to check the earlier ones. So there's no blaze powder around any of these blocks. There's nothing under the cauldron behind it on either block. So, I guess, so, okay, we're gonna, we're, we're, I, we're executing the final solution. Where is it? I think the solution really was poison, and I think you really just need to find... The blaze powder, but there's just no blaze powder. Unless there was blaze powder in here. Which would not make any sense. But I think that was it. I think the solution is get blaze powder. Obviously make a poison potion. That's splash for some reason. Look under the furnace in the hall. To the lava room. Oh... No, nope. yeah, it's not there. That would have made sense, but yeah, it's not there. Hmm. Thank. Okay, chat. Now you've seen a funny escape room and a very mediocre one. So I'll give you the chance again. Choose your own adventure times two. Do you want to play another? Or do you want to not? <laughs> <laughs> this is your choice. <laughs> That's also a giant torch, by the way. Oh, wait. Actually? Actually, I just realized something. I'm pretty sure when you enter the portal, the escape isn't done. Because I just... I didn't even think about that. Hang on. One sec. First, let's just delete all the bedrock. Because I just have to see. I just have to see if there's... Do you see? Do you see any blaze powder? Nope. No blaze powder? No blaze powder? Okay. So yeah, actually, when you enter the portal, I'm pretty sure there's more rooms. Yeah, I don't know why I thought that was the exit. Of course it isn't. So then you gotta clutch again with what this time? Another cobweb. Great. Original. Having fun? Let's just speed run through this so we can get to an actually good one. I'll throw the splash potion up there. I accidentally caught the splash. Whatever. So then we swim up for some reason. Because why not? Just let the players swim for no reason. to waste their time. Get the ladder. I don't know if they know you can pick these up. They probably do. I, I literally got it and then I failed it. Oh my gosh. Escape rooms just really aren't streamable because of things like this. Like, I don't know what maps aren't going to work. And also, it's just a lot of slowness a lot of the time. Like this. Because you have to get lucky and pick up the ladder. Like, it's literally luck-based. Oh my god, I got it. You know what? That counts. I have to be a bit more patient in picking it up. Um, hang on. Sorry. I probably have to... Ugh. Update on when... 
on what went on in the past five minutes. Uh, bad escape room. I'm bored. Everyone's depressed. Instead of fake escape rooms with fake lava, do real ones with real lava. Nice. Make this stream go on longer so Avatar gets no sleep. Avatar's back? Yo! Hey, you know who else is back? Uh, not me. Cause, uh... Cause, um... Cause, uh... Wait. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Come to turbo. <laughs> it's a TurboTax ad. <laughs> Guys. Guys, you won't believe it. It's the Be Right Back music. Okay, bye. One second.
Okay, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Guys, I've been streaming for so long, I needed to take a break. I had to go get... Um, anyway. Anyway, alright. So. Minecraft escape room. Let's go... There's just cobwebs. Let's just remove the cobwebs. Yeah. I'll go pick up the ladders in a second. I know I can pick them up. There's a rabbit's foot. Look at me playing the map. I'm not doing this. Okay, look. Super long thing of cobwebs. Cool. <sighs> Jeez. Okay. You know what we'll do? You know what we'll do? We'll make a shortcut. Because these cobwebs don't make any sense. They don't make any sense. So this is our new shortcut. Let's go pick up the ladders now. 90% sure you can pick them up. Nice. Please pick up, please pick up, please pick up. Nice. And the last one. Nice. So we got all six ladders. Let's take our new shortcut we made. I will get the item frame. Calm down. And then... Obviously, we get an old bottle and a redstone. Um, hmm. Okay. So, I we're probably not supposed to have the lantern, to be honest. Because, yeah. So, uh, yeah. Uh, so how's everyone? <laughs> Ken's done eating. Actually, I'm not done eating. I just brought food downstairs. To my room. Oh yeah, I live in the basement. I live in my parents' basement, guys. <laughs> so, this is just a minecart, and this is just a brewing stand, and we still don't have blaze. But oh, but there's blaze. There wasn't blaze in the last brewing stand, was there? Wait, I just want to check. 
Oh, the two are a mirror of each other. That's cool. I just have to check. So the whole map is mirrored. Because it would... Sorry, it would just be so funny. I'd be so mad if this had boys in it. It doesn't. Okay, okay, okay. So we're not crazy. I'm not crazy. Because that whole time we were looking for blaze rods, if there was already fuel, and we didn't even notice, that would have been absurd. But there not. There wasn't. There was no fuel. Have we considered that there's water in the nether? I didn't even think of that. Anyway. So we're over here now. And actually, we can still collect the ladders. So I'm going to do that. Uh, it's very tricky, but I know it's possible. You just have to do this. At the right height. The trick is just knowing what the right height is. Pretty sure it's like that. Pretty sure I'm too high, actually. Oh, I know what it is. You just, yeah. So you have to just stand... Look, we're learning something. You ha you gotta stand at the high enough coordinates that you don't depend on that ladder. And then you gotta get lucky and pick up that one. We failed. So I wanna get up to Y equals 160 because that's how I know I'm fully on this ladder. I can let go of shift for a second to drop. Okay, 160. This is how you break escape rooms. You know crazy glitches like this. This isn't really a glitch. I just mean, you gotta know these mechanics. And get lucky. You cut the footage. You cut the footage to the one time you got lucky. And picked up the ladder. Let go of shift to lower ourselves down so we're as close as we can safely be. Okay, right there. That's the optimal height. Hmm. We can also crouch pretty far out, to be honest. Like here. This is good. There we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna cheat. <laughs> I'm not gonna waste our time. So, but we now have blaze powder, so we can finally make a jump boost potion. He's gonna spend like five minutes going up three blocks. <laughs> hey, that's how you how that's how you cheat maps. Actually, it's totally not even worth it because it's probably less efficient than the intended solution. This is so fun. Okay, we've got two jump boost potions. I might as well make them longer while I'm here because why not? I don't think we'll need the redstone anywhere else. Actually, we probably will. Whatever. We, we don't have to make them splash. That doesn't matter. Okay. So we'll take the minecart with us. Um, can I just not waste time here and you guys can just trust me that I can collect this ladder and get up here? Like, like, it uses all the same principles as before. You'd place the ladder like this. Actually, not necessarily. That's not necessarily true. Because you still have to get up. No, no, no. Because even if, even if I mine the ladder, we're talking hypotheticals, like optimal scenario. If I mine the ladder and, and it dropped like that, right? Then I would just go down. And then I could theoretically do the glitch all the way up here, which would take forever. But eventually, I'd get back up and get a second chance. Uh, and then and then we try it again. Okay, the odds of it happening are super. You know what? Let's just not. I'll I'll I won't do that. I won't do it that way. But you can. You technically can. Oh yeah, we do we do need that there. Oh let's just put it here. So we can get it back. And if I don't get it back. Oh I did. Okay. I was gonna say if I don't get it back, I'll just leave it. 
Hmm. So it's like the last room, but upside down. Oh, everything's upside down. That's it. The whole torch here is flipped. Hmm. Okay. So it's like we're going back through everything. We honestly probably did not need all those ladders. I think this is just a dumb parkour map. Oh, so look, guys, we figured out what the intended solution was supposed to be with the lantern. Apparently, we were supposed to make a lantern. This is this is showing us what the intended solution in the last room is going to be. Can be like, so I escaped the prison by spending 24 hours mining this one block, but since that would take forever, let's just say I did it. I didn't do that. I, I left the ladder. I decided to leave the ladder there. I can technically get it, but you're right. It would not be worth the time. It would just take too long. Oh, bro, you just literally, you just minecart in. Epic crawl glitch, MLG. Pog. So, guys, theoretically, I could pick up all of these ladders. <laughs> I probably don't even need them. I'm not even going to. I, I, I honestly am not going to even need them. I'm willing to... Why? Okay. Oh. It goes back in there. That's another unintuitive thing. Like, no one would think, no one would realize that that reappears here. Or maybe someone would, but I wouldn't. I'm not smart enough to realize that. Bruh. Okay, there's a way to fix this. We just do that. Let's pick that up. Let's break the crafting table actually while we're here, now that I've realized that you can do this, because it's the same idea as the boat. Okay, I said I wouldn't mind those. All right, so let's enter this room. We didn't even use the jump boost potions. How do we do this? How do we get in here? Uh, I'll figure this out. There we go. Uh, now, let's say hypothetically that I spent time mining these, but I didn't want to bore my stream chat, so I mined them in creative mode. Okay. This will probably be the final room, because it's the room we started in. Let's get powered rails. I don't know what we'd want these for. Lantern superiority. Yeah. And now, um, nothing in this room? Okay, I'll just go down. We can always go back up. We still have the ladders. Boat. That's it? It ends with a boat? Oh, and your boat clutch. Yo, guys. Yo, guys, look at this. Look at this. It wants me to boat clutch. Do you see a problem? <laughs> Do you see any problems on the screen with this concept? With this concept of making me use a boat to get down? <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. It would be so much easier to just boat, like, <laughs> but... The fact that you can mine the wood. Anyway, let's let it burn. So, that was the torch. I rate this map, um, 0 out of 10. Um, 10 out of 10 for exploitability, though. Very fun, very fun to exploit. And, um, yeah. Now, guys. Now, guys. You want to play another? Do you want to play another? If you want to play another map, Click to the left of your screen. That won't do anything. If you want to go to bed or move on with um, whatever you're doing before the stream, click to the right. You probably have more homework to do. You probably still have something you have to do. You probably have something you have to study. You could probably spend your time better than watching 
some guy download random Minecraft maps a 13 year old made. What do you think of Seawalk Gaming's new escape room videos? I thought they were an improvement. Yes, they absolutely are. I help him build them. That's why they're good. No, I'm kidding. Actually, his last one, I barely helped on that one at all. Like, I did nothing. I really can't say I took any credit. I just, like, reviewed some of the puzzles for him. Um, but yeah, la his last, his latest one was one of my favorites. Seriously. Although there is kind of a scuffed mistake at the end. I, I actually, I can't say anything without spoiling, because there's kind of a storyline to the video. But the story doesn't make any sense. Like, there's a way you could... Anyway, I could debunk it. Everyone says click to the left. Oh my gosh, leftists in my chat. All these leftists, all they want to do is play more Minecraft. Okay. <laughs> that joke is going to make someone mad. <laughs> Alright, I'll check the next one. Dootsy dootsy doo. Has an ending. Ah, uh, the stream doesn't. Okay. Next map. I'm just gonna scroll. Um. Wait. I'll try and find it without the database. I think I can. Probably. Actually, do you guys just want to suggest one? Like, like one on the list. Have have, let's open the list. I'll let you guys suggest one. Yeah, I'll actually let you guys suggest any one. I'll be honest. Like, since I'm playing these on stream anyway, I might as well, like, let you choose. Earlier, I, I wanted to only pick ones that I wasn't going to end up actually using in my video, but I don't care anymore. I'll just, I'll, I'll play literally any one you want. <laughs> so let's uh, yeah let me open this chrome chrome yo guys look it's you they're saying do 15 let me control minus so you can see a little bit more at a time here i'll scroll through these a little slowly just so you know what number is what or you can go to that link you can go to that link right there and find it yourself if there's a specific one probably your own or your friend's one or just a name you recognize. I don't know how we're going to vote on this. Because everyone's going to suggest something different. But, um... If a lot of people all want one map, go for it. If everyone has a different idea, I, I have no idea what I'm going to do. <laughs> Those last two, I can definitely make content out of. I can at least make content out of the boat idea where I was using the boat to get the higher platforms and be like, haha, the builder did not anticipate this. But I don't know if that was intentional or not. Maybe that was the solution. I can definitely make content out of the Terra Gaming one with the ladder because I don't think a lot of people know the ladder glitch. And I think showing the ladder glitch as like... But also it doesn't even matter because you don't even have to pick up the ladders. That's the problem. It's not like you're being all super clever. You literally don't even use the ladders. Wait, how did we even get out of the Terra Gaming one? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, we just dropped down some hole. Yeah, what what the heck was that ending? I don't know. I just have to figure out a way to make it funny. Like, oh, look how bad this is. You can pick up the ladders. Even though no one would think that that... Okay. Everyone says 15. Actually, only one person says 15. He's spamming it. Oh, no. Everyone does say 15. Except one guy who says do 69, which I think you're just saying that because it's funny. It's called the Pit of Pain, which is a very funny name for a prison. That's number 69. <laughs> but yeah, let's do 15. Everyone's spamming 15. I get it. I get it. At least you're all agreeing. You're all agreeing on something. Let's go to 15. Who made 15? Pasta. The lasagna? Huh? The lasagna? You guys want to play the lasagna? Okay. Is this guy in chat? Is that why you want to play it? Is that, I mean... 
Or or do you or are you guys just suggesting this because it says lasagna? Was the guy in chat? What's the name? Pasta guy. I don't even see pasta guy in chat. You guys just want it because lasagna. That's the only reason you're picking it. Is because it says lasagna. You guys... <laughs> okay. Just because lasagna. Alright. Uh, 90% done. Placing it. Okay. Let's go find the lasagna. I should delete them after I play it. Actually, no. I shouldn't. Alright, the lasagna, guys. Let's play the lasagna. Alright, so the last room, uh, the first one we played, that wasn't the adventure map, right? It was super exploitable. I escaped it like three times, right? The second map we played was almost impossible. Like, you had to know things you had no way of knowing, right? The one with the item frame glitch, Retair Gaming's one. Maybe this one will be the perfect in between. Maybe this will be the perfect prison. I mean, it's lasagna after all. Maybe this will be just beautiful, crisp, perfect map. The perfect balance between the two. I hope you enjoy my map. This is your map? Or, oh, you just mean. Oh, you're Pasta Guy 27! You're Pasta Guy? Okay. Your map better be the perfect mix. I just need you to tell me before I start playing Lasagna Man, Pasta Guy, Pasta Guy 27. Is this map deliberately bad? Because some of them are deliberately bad, but obviously some are intentionally good. I just want to know if this is one of the deliberately bad ones or if it, or if it's going to be good before I play. Just so I'm prepared, because if it's deliberately bad and I know it, then, you know, it is meant to be deliberately bad. All he said was yes. I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Let's ladder up. Hmm. Hmm. Earth 5 will not give you a whole new perspective. This escape room is called the Lasagna. There are no hoppers in this escape room. Keep inventories on. Okay. Oh, dang, we're actually in the map. Oh, I should have kept the bed. Oh, shoot. Wait, I didn't... I thought I was being clever. I thought I was being clever. No, I thought I was being clever. Okay, he says it's a legit escape room. Bro, okay, sorry. I, I thought... Okay. I thought that was an escape, but actually I kind of want the bed. Can I go back and get the bed? Because I didn't realize... I didn't... <laughs> I didn't realize that was just how to enter the map. Uh, uh, oops. I thought I was escaping, but I wasn't. Okay, let's get the string while we're waiting. Are there barriers in the roof? There aren't. That's a little suspicious. Okay, I'm going back to the beginning. Where's the beginning? I don't have cheats. Never mind. Let's not cheat. No! Wait, okay, we're restarting. We're completely restarting. We're restarting. I failed. I failed the map, now let's restart, all right? Where's where's the beginning? Okay, we're restarting, this never happened. Brand new, we're, we're starting out, we're just starting out. We failed the map and now we're playing second time. That's what's going on. This is our second attempt at the map. And this time we're taking it seriously because we know that this is just the beginning. Okay. I set the spawn point anyway. Okay. Okay. Cool. So, let's go. Let's use our little ladder exploit. Actually, let's just see what this guy wants. A ladder and bed. Okay. Makes sense. Wait, what do you give? Piston? Why would we want a piston? We have a lever. I'm getting the worst luck. 
brother. There we go. Okay. So, oh, I guess the pistons to get you in crawl. Hmm. Hmm. But do we need crawl mode? Because there's just a button. We can press the button. Was that intentional? We can't put the bed in the window. Oh, also... The yeah, cycle's off, so we can't sleep in the bed. Oh, but we can die. Wait. Wait, actually, this guy has a point now that I think about it. Um, so, I was gonna say you can't put the bed in the window. No, yeah, I was right. No, I was right the whole time. I literally... Same line of logic. Like, I sat here, and I thought, oh, maybe you can place the ladder, and then you can place the bed on the... No, you can't. Never mind. So I was right the whole time. I just had to double check. Because I, I thought it was... Yeah. You can't... Because you can't sleep in a bed when it's obstructed. Okay. So, back to this. We have a cobblestone, a cobble deep slate, a blackstone, three glass, a phantom membrane, Another wart, which obviously means we're going to craft a brewing stand because these are all stones. Break these. Or put a tripwire in them, maybe. Or not. Let's use the ladders. Can you place. No. Spoiler warning dying from fall damage means you will not live. Oh. Wait, so just ladder clutch. What? Wait, is there barriers? Wait, this is it? It says F5 on the ground. Actually, you can clutch pretty well with a bed. But we won't escape yet. I want to see what's behind the barrel. Even though I could just get out. Okay, nothing behind the barrel. Oh, we have the wood. Okay. Okay, so we can get the blaze rods. I'm sure this is not intended. So now we can brew... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, let's make the crafting table. And brew... Oops. Oopsie doop. And with this, we'll craft a. We'll, um. Oh, I didn't make the glass. I didn't make the water bottle. Oh no. So sad. So sad. Anyway, <laughs> you escaped. Uh, um, yeah. Dying means you don't live, yeah. I did consider bed clutching, but I thought bed clutching would be a lot harder. Yeah. That's a pretty easy one to get out of, unfortunately. But I see. So you were supposed to just make a slow falling potion. Pretty straightforward. You know, get all the ingredients to make slow falling. And then make it. Classic brewing puzzle. Not bad. Brew. You missed the barrel. I literally don't need the... Oh my gosh. I do not need the barrel. Wait. No, I... Oh, he's joking. I'm being trolled. I'm being trolled. He's a troll. I didn't even realize. I'm sorry, I thought I eliminated all the cheese. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. Hey, hey, pasta. Listen. The prison's called lasagna. Exactly, Alex. What is lasagna without cheese? What is lasagna? I'm using that in my video. I'm using that line in my video. <laughs> I'm stealing that.
Hmm? Oh, yeah. <laughs> some, some in chat's like, that's not how red stone and repeaters work. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect redstone. You guys want to do Pit of Pain next? <laughs> I love this. Okay, is my is my slow falling done brewing? Oh, it is. All right, now I can finally escape, guys. I'm gonna escape. Yo, we did it. All right. Canadian stealing jokes confirmed. Yeah, that's how you gotta play this game. What are you gonna do? Cancel me? Oh my gosh! Hopper, hopper, hopper. Yo guys, why does it say two backwards F? Everyone's saying pit of pain. You guys want pit of pain? <laughs> uh, okay. I'll go get pit of pain for you. Let's see, Pit of Pain by Doctor Who Kobe. This guy's so lucky that he's number 69. Okay. Currently downloading Pit of Pain now. That was redundant. Cancel Canadian, yeah. Put the repeater facing into a block with the torch on it. Yep. It says 27. Oh, you're right. Oh, well, kinda. It kinda says 27. Okay. Currently extracting Pit of Pain, version 1.1. That means this went through multiple iterations. <laughs> the Pit of Pain went through multiple iterations. Okay. Um... Currently putting it in my folder of folders. Let's go play The Pit of Pain. Oh, his name is 27, true! Oh, you guys are genius. His name has a 27 in it. That's why it says 27. It's not an F5, it's a 27. Okay, this is it. Boys and girls and everyone else. <laughs> the pit of pain dang this is a good looking map okay no we're surrounded by barriers i hate it i hate it i hate it i hate it can we get a can we get an l barrier in the chat okay guys good luck with this one so, real quick question, um, do you guys see any containers? I don't think I see any containers here, I'm not sure. Like, I don't know, is there something I'm missing? I don't see any containers. This prison is impossible, it's the pit of pain after all, yeah. Guys, seriously though, like, there, there aren't any containers, do you know? Like, am I missing something? Where's, where are the containers? Where are the containers, guys? Where are the containers? And someone says, yeah, I see a barrel. <laughs> yeah, okay. Anyway. <clears throat> so, I just realized why this is called the Pit of Pain. I just figured it out. I don't know if you guys have figured it out yet, but I know what it is. And I really don't like it. But I know exactly why it's called the Pit of Pain. Let's read the rules. Let me see. The trick that allows you to scale this entire room with just the items in your barrel is not allowed. Generating cobblestone is not allowed. What? Okay. Well, I was going to what I was going to say is you can use a trick with trap doors to infinitely scale, which a lot of people already know, but that's what I was going to do. But now I'm being told that's not allowed. Which, who are you to tell me what's allowed and what's not? Sure, it's your escape room, but it's my... Me. Hmm. Should we cheat? Or should we follow the rules? Someone says break the barrel. 
<laughs> I don't know, bud. I don't know about that. Um, wait, can I, can I F5? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I best not be breaking the slime block either. You're gonna have to bounce on that thing a lot, aren't you? And not hit the barriers. I don't even know. Um, I don't know what they want me to do. If you need help, DM Dr. Who Kobe. Generating cobbles on... Okay, so... So, basically, I'm not allowed to do it the way that you would think I'm supposed to do it. I guess this is the intended way. Oh, and then I'll be able to reach that hopper. So basically, I found a cheese with my map, but instead of patching it, I'm just going to say, don't do it. That's, that's basically what I said. Okay, so what am I supposed to do if I'm not allowed to scale with trapdoors? How do I reach the hopper? I'm so confused because I don't know what's allowed and what's not. Checking on the trapdoors for a bit. <laughs> True. <laughs> <clears throat> a good escape room shouldn't restrict you. Yep, exactly. You gotta have to bounce on that thing. A lot of shit. Oh my gosh. Someone says, hello, Ken, how are you? I'm uh tired, but stream chat won't let me leave. They've held me hostage. I have 64 raw salmon and saturation. What kind of capitalist world do we live in where I have raw salmon and saturation? And an egg that says reset. What is this world? You can use the trapdoor scaling, just not all the way up. Oh, is that the rule? I can partially scale? Do you think that's it? Because I don't know what else it would be if... It's literally 1 p.m. Uh, it's not 1 p.m. Wrong. Your time zone's wrong. You live in the incorrect time zone. This is so annoying. The axe breaks everything instantly. Wait, can you even do this glitch in a one by one tunnel? They're probably, but if so, I'm... Wait. At least the way I remember how to do this, I don't think you can. Consume the egg. Hmm. Wait, how do you do this in a one by one tunnel? Because you can't mine the next trap door. You can't do it like this because you can't pick this up. One of these days, I'm going to break the slime block. I'm amazed that I haven't broken it yet. Oh my gosh, I can't. Only break one. Sacrifice the salmon into the pit. Look under the furnace in the hall to the lava room. Shut up! If we spam, maybe the lag will stop. Hmm. Pray to the barrel god. Ken, so get as high as you can with the trapdoors like you did, then bounce on the slime and open the hopper. I do not understand how you're this dumb. But okay, I'll do that. All right. Are we back? God. Let me know when the lag ends. I just need to know if we're not lagging anymore because OBS is still telling me it's lagging. Break the sign block with the trapdoor above it.
Then you'll break the trap door after you die. I thought of that. Okay, look. So we can't bounce. Because obviously you're just going to do that. There is the interesting idea, of course, of trapdoor yourself, then place the trapdoor here, then see if we can pick up the slime block. <clears throat> okay, we lost the slime block, guys. I'm going to put it back. Wait, I can't. Why can't I? What? Cheat, cheat prevention? Oh, there's invisible armor stands there. Oh, is that so you can't break the slime block? I think you're not supposed to break the slime block then. Because, uh, because of the armor stands that are there to prevent you from breaking it. I think that's deliberately unintentional. But, since we're out of options anyway, use the, use the egg. The egg doesn't do anything. I just I just threw it. It does nothing, guys. So we're gonna place the trapdoor here. We're gonna try this again. And instead we will break the slime block, pick it up, and then die. And then respawn. Guys. Guys, look what you've done. We don't even have the reset egg anymore. <laughs> Guys, we're in, the, we're in eternal torment. Thanks to the pit of pain. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, interesting. So, I think we lost. Oh, you're going to go to, like, an end portal at the top. There's, there's like, an ender eye in each of these. I don't think this works. Like, looking at the items, it does not look like there's a sufficient amount to even do this puzzle. Either that or I'm mega unbrain. Hmm? Hmm? Okay. <clears throat> wow. Hit of Pain is quite a map. It's quite a map. Um... And our reset egg is obviously gone. Just, guys, just use the egg that doesn't exist. Yep. You missed the barrel. You are in the pit of pain. I am. I think we took the L. I can, I can reset this if we want to try again. Can space QB has an idea. Yeah, that's some, that doesn't work. Ah. <sighs> I'm in I am in immense pain to be honest. I'm in immense pain. Let me go get a refreshed version of the map. Oh, I cut it, so of course it doesn't exist. I don't even know where to start on this one. You should throw it up and get a chicken. Can I think you might be mega unbrain? You guys haven't figured it out either. Unless you have. Have you? Did you try using F5? I will end you. I will... S yeah. Hmm. Okay. Second attempt. Someone says, I think I know it. What do you think you know? The solution? Got boy. All right. So 
I really don't think we're supposed to break this slime. Do you guys think we're supposed to break the slime? Pick up barrel first. Guys, we can't pick... Oh, you think if we crawl here, we'll pick up the barrel? There's not a chance... It's not guaranteed, is the thing. Like, it's not guaranteed that you pick it up. Like, there's a chance you don't. And we can't risk it. Yeah. You want to see how many times we can place a barrel? And how many times we won't pick it up? Look at this. I don't think picking up the barrel is the solution unless we place a trap door so we can get it. Yeah, that that one I only picked up because I placed the barrel too fast. And it pushed it towards me. So maybe the solution would be, say, put a trap door like... Oh, yeah, you could also make the argument that maybe the solution is... Um... Throw all the items. Don't pick them up somehow. Yeah. So if it's just... Maybe it's this. Throw all the items to the respawn point. Don't pick them up. Oh my gosh. Throw all the items. I can't do this. I was going to say throw them all, then break the barrel, drop down, and pick it up and respawn. Someone says, it's so simple. Since you bounce... The lower second time you bounce, you can lower the trap door to land on it again. Since you bounce lower the second time you bounce, you can lower the trap door. Oh, do you mean like... Do you mean like do actual witchcraft with the fact that you can break trap doors instantly? Like... Are you referring to literal witchcraft? You're saying, you're saying, wait, so if I, oh, I get your idea here. Hmm. This seems very skill based. But let me try it. That is that what you're thinking though? Is that the idea you had? That's what it sounds like. I don't think I'll pick it up in time because there's a delay between when you pick up the item. That is not what you were thinking. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, this won't work because of the pick up an item delay. Oh, unless it's this, this first, and then. Let's go! <laughs> Wait, which, which wall was this on? That one. Okay. And this glitch, hey, by definition, you can't do this glitch infinitely because every time you jump, you don't necessarily come back one block less. And therefore, this doesn't apply to the rule that the glitch that allows you to scale this entire room with just the items of the barrel, that isn't it. This doesn't apply because it's not that glitch. Oh, we still just barely can't reach the hopper. Break the bottom one. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So now... I don't believe we can do this a second time. And we still can't reach the barrel by just, like, just barely. But one more time and we would be able to. Um... Imagine you just can't get out. Uh, that would be pain, yeah. So... This is the first good puzzle I've seen. If this is intentional, this is the first actually good one I've seen. 
What is the trick in the book then? I don't know. I don't think you can even do it. The trick that the book says. Anyway, let's just test if this works. I don't think it will, but we might as well try. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you don't get enough height to do it a second time, I don't, I believe. So unless it actually does want you to pick up the barrel, which I also don't think is the case. Throw 10 fish down, watch them bounce. Well, it'd be funnier if they were actual fish, though. Like living fish. Throw the Ender Eye and beat Minecraft. Brilliant. So, can you reach it if you get on the very edge of the block? No. DM the guy? No. I'm not falling that low. I'm not stooping that low. Do your original idea with the insta brick trap doors. I can't. That doesn't work. Unless you have a different idea you're referring to. Ask him how. Ask him what you are doing wrong. No, 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 I'm not DMing them. Maybe if you do only one block instead of two with the second trap door. Um, you mean like this? I, I highly doubt it. I highly doubt this. Well, we'll see. Yeah, not quite. It's just barely not going to work. Sorry, chat is so delayed, by the way. You can blame my family for that. Hmm. I like this part, though. Craft the diamond into a diamond nugget. Mm -hmm. Can glow, go one block lower and jump, jump and. You mean one block even lower, lower? I think that, I think the one place is the highest you can do it. The what, the original place. I think that's the highest. That, that it works. Wherever I did it last. Unless this works. Maybe this works. I, whatever, whatever, let's try it. This would be so goofy if this was it. This is the lowest height we can do. Yeah, it doesn't work. Unless it's just bad timing and I'm somehow, it, like visually it doesn't look like it works. Why are you blaming your family on chat delay? Because my family is lagging, like they're taking up the bandwidth and every time the stream lags, the delay increases every single time. Yeah. Hmm. You want to get, you want to try getting the barrel? The, the original idea for getting the barrel would be like, You'd place the trap door like here. And then you'd come over here and you'd like hope that you get the barrel. Like get really lucky. You want to just try the barrel thing again. See if we ever pick it up. No, because it's blocked by the bedrock. Um, can try reset egg. The reset egg does nothing. It just, <laughs> the reset egg literally does nothing. Unlag the string so the delay increases. But can try the reset egg. You know, you know, no matter what we do, the stream delay is going to stay. We can't delete the stream delay. Move the trap door. I don't even know. I don't even know what's going on anymore. 
Put the trap door there and flip it down. <laughs> it's too, we're too delayed to even know what people are talking about. I can't put it in the void. You need to hit the wall. I tried. What? Dude, chat is confusing me so much. Ken uses the to be in Chrome mode. Delete your family. Delete your problems. No, hit it with a wall, bro. Ken, if you break the trap door, you can crawl next to the barrel and pick it up. Just tested it. Okay, but look. Do you mean this? Or something else? Oh, hit the- Oh, that's why you guys are saying hit a wall. You need, You mean I have to hit- The- Guys- Last time we hit the the we hit the egg on a wall and nothing happened. So that guys, shut up. Do you want me to open the map again? Okay, watch this. Ready? 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 A chicken. That's it. it the NVT tag is like the color of the text. It doesn't reset. We tried it earlier. All right, I'm listening to the barrel people now. Because the people who are complaining about the egg, I, I don't like them. All right, so let's listen to you guys now with the barrel strat. Take the barrel in crawl mode. So do you want me to be in crawl mode here? Like, do you want me to be one block down, like the same height as the slime or above the slime? I'm just watching his chat reacts to me murdering a chicken. So where, what height should I be in crawl mode at? Bounce the chicken on the barrel. Yeah. Respawn the chicken. The chicken was in my way. Jump down and catch the barrel. Same height as the slime. See, we can't do that because there's no keep inventory. So there's no point in jumping down and catching the barrel. We don't get it back. There's no keep inventory. Get the same height as the slime. All right. Uh, you mean with two of these? Let me know. Just let me know if any of these you've got a problem with. Because I can get the barrel, but then I can't get the trap door back, right? That's why I haven't wanted to do this. I didn't want to do this. I haven't been trying this because I don't get the trap door back. I, I've thought of this, but how do I get the trap door? I suppose there's a reality where maybe instead, what if I placed it like that? Then I could break the barrel. Okay, I didn't even get it that time, but... So if what you're saying is... 
um, this, then say we throw all our items and respawn here. And then flip the trapdoor back up. Then place this here to get and crawl and then crouch here and then hope we get the trapdoor like that. That would work, but that's luck based. Break the slime? No. If I break the slime, I can't put it back because there's invisible armor stands, which you can see in Spectator. The I can't use the slime as a block. So, the only way that this whole thing works is if the solution is uh if 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 this plan we're like forming is the correct one it would be to go and crawl place a trapdoor on the wall here place one uh okay let's just put let's just put me here just to save time pick up the barrel row the items flip the trapdoor and die just deal with the fact that it's luck based. Respawn, pick the items up, flip the trapdoor again. Hope we get it, but we don't get it. But we got it the first time, so whatever. That's the best solution we have. Get lucky. You guys say just cope with the fact that it's luck based. Okay. And now that we have the barrel, do you think we can make it now that we have the barrel? Why can't I place this? Okay, there we go. Break this. Jump. Pick it up. Jump. Place the trap door. Place the barrel. Get the hopper. Oh my gosh. Uh... Bots are solved. Um, so do you think that's it? Do you think that's actually it? Because then what? I'm pretty sure that the um, door doesn't get you high enough. Just doing this to save time. The door doesn't quite get you high enough to open this hopper. So I don't think that was even it. Unless we do actually do the slime block thing again. In which case, oh my gosh. What if it's like... Yeah, I think you just barely can't reach that barrel. Or that hopper. That's the end of the escape room. And chat keep holding him hostage. Dude. I might just give up. <laughs> Pain. Pain level. Pain level's too hard. The level of pain. Okay, wait. Crazy idea here. Crazy idea. We just want to try real quick. Watch this. What if you break the barrel? Oh! Oh! Guys, I'm so smart! Did you see that? Replay that. Go back 10 seconds. That was so cool. Okay. No way! Okay. Now what? I don't even know if that was intentional. Wait, you can't even get the hopper. This is such a dumb map. I don't want to spend hours playing this. Are you allowed to break deep slate? I can't break the deep slate because there's barriers around me everywhere. And I don't know a safe way to get the hopper back. Well, yeah, I don't yeah, I don't know a safe way. Oh, and that hopper's screwed. Yeah, so either we really don't know the correct solution 
or this map is actually broken and we'll never know unless we talk to the guy i don't know if we just don't get it use the trap doors to crawl the, the trap doors the trap doors are down they're kind of out of commission they're right there but hey you know what maybe maybe we do this the epic skill trick shot thing again wait what this stupid axe i actually <sighs> never mind i'm done i'm done with pit of pain i was going to i was going to do the thing where i break a trap door again but i broke all the trap doors cuz this axe goes too fast it does it just it's just such a scuff map i cannot handle the fact that that axe mines so quickly it's so annoying Okay, guys, please, do we, do we play another one, or do we please not? Someone says do 420. Rage quitter? Yeah, I rage quit. I don't even care. That was a dumb map. We're not playing. Dude, we didn't get through 1% of that. We unironically didn't get through like, well, like 10%. There is, there is like 90% of that map left to go. And I'm already pretty sure it's broken. We've done that with all the maps, basically. It's not really rage quitting so much as it is we genuinely don't know if the map's broken because these were all made by 13-year-olds. Okay, okay. We're just here to review them. All right, guys. Here's the database. Pick your favorite number that isn't just 69. Because that last one was 69. We already did 69. Don't do it again. Please. There's one called A Very Good Idea. There's one called The Anvil. One called Levitation Vault. Yeah. You can just go check through the list. Uh, and you know what? I'm making an executive decision. Whichever one you pick is the last one we're doing. I'll give you a minute. Do 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 I see spams for 68, spams for 17, spams for 27, spams for 49. You guys got to agree on something. Here, I'll make a poll since you cannot agree. Engage with your audience. Ask a question. My question is number. The answers are 27. We already did 15. I think, or I'm really dumb. 68, 49. Anyone who's not spamming in chat will have no opinion, which is funny, but hey, democracy. At least you can't, you can't complain with whatever result we get.
Okay, sorry. Back had to just munch food. <clears throat> 27, you guys say. It's a very close race between 27 and 68. Look, if 27 is really short, we'll play 68 too. But let's play 27. Uh, like us. Downloading it now. Extracting it now. Saving it now. Okay. Boyd's Vault. So, what is so special about Void's Vault? Why do you guys want this one so much? Um, let's see. So, hello, Canadian. Oh my gosh. Man just said hello. It seems you want to escape this escape room. Nah. Honestly, I could I could care less. I could go to bed right now. I could literally totally go to bed right now. It is so late where I am. <clears throat> but sure. Well, I'll give you some extra info to help you out. The light cycle is off. Weather cycle is off. Good. Mob spawning is off. Also good. Have fun. No. One, six, four, nine, two, three, five. One six four nine two three five. Okay. I wonder if anything is under this lectern. <laughs> I don't like that block. Opposite of see what gaming equals ocean jewel reading. <laughs> Wait, that's a good <laughs> that's a good line. I don't think the opposite of sea is the ocean though. But, yeah, lecterns do input redstone power, but I don't think it would be right to assume that there's hidden redstone. We wouldn't be able to see it that way anyway. I don't know what I'm doing. Anyway, let's see what we can see of this room. I see a bunch of uh, a glass. And, uh, huh. Don't tell me I have to mine this block. I don't want to mine that block. And we will hope that there's actually barriers in the ceiling. There is, in fact, barrier blocks in the ceiling. So guys, let's make a quick let's make a quick decision. Do you want to spend 80 seconds mining this block or do you want to break it in creative mode? <clears throat> I'll let you choose. You've got 80 seconds to decide. Okay, I can't actually see chat. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna check. No creative. Everyone says creative. Yeah. Okay. <gasps> no way! There's a chest hidden underneath with a slab, an iron ingot, food, even though I have... Oh, I don't have saturation this time. And nether quartz. Let's break the barrel. I mean the chest. It's good. We're going to lose it, but who cares? So. So. We can use a slab. To almost get in that room. And we can also make nuggets. I'll be honest, that doesn't really change much. Because, um, yeah, the slab isn't enough to get in there.
But then I had a very good idea. I used F5. So using F5 gave me a whole new perspective, and I was able to see this room that had a bunch of snow in it. Strange. On another wall, I noticed. Um... That there seemed to be nothing. On another wall, I noticed... What appeared to be... A line of redstone. See, using this line of redstone, I inferred that if I placed the lectern somewhere on this wall, it would trigger some of this redstone. But I wasn't sure where to place it. You guys want to know what the ultimate strategy is in escape rooms? This, is, this strategy will make you very mad or very proud that I'm going to do it. This is the absolute... Like, you are going to hate... You're either going to love or hate this strategy. I feel like it's a fair strategy. Some people will complain, but I might do it anyway. But it is the ultimate escape room strategy. It is the most powerful method. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. You can't stop me. I don't care if you're mad. Cry about it. We're doing the most powerful of exploit. It's actually not the most powerful exploit. Gonna raise the render distance a bit. Let's wander around a bit and then save that replay file. <laughs> People are saying, no, don't do it. You can't stop me, chat. You can't. Okay. So somehow we need to trigger the skulk sensor. That seems pretty sim wait. Didn't I walk in this corner? I don't know how it didn't detect me. But okay. So then Okay. Let's just do that. I'll check back in the replay if we need it again. So just walk in this corner. Wait. I'm walking in this corner. Okay, I'm checking the replay again. What's going on? Oh, do you have to activate it like multiple times, do you think? Because it's a really long... Wait, that, that redstone doesn't work, does it? I'm pretty sure this redstone doesn't work. Wait, I'm actually... Okay. Like, I'm pretty confident that redstone doesn't do anything. Let's just... Hang on. Oh. Oh. So guys, we're on example two of a map where there is literally physically no way you would know what the solution is. The last one was Terra Gaming's map where you just had to magically see something in Spectator where you had to throw an item frame. This time it's this. Uh, apparently the solution is keep walking around in that specific corner for hours and hours and hours until this lights. Actually, not actually hours. Why is there so many? Okay. But yeah. I guess you kind of could have known the solution if you could see the redstone clearly and you knew what was in the hopper. But I don't think so. I guess, okay, I, I guess it is It's It's possible you could have inferred it. But I don't think it's right to assume someone could figure that out. The amount of times... I have to do this. It's insane. Walk. Oh, you've got to walk, then wait. Okay, I kind of see where they're coming from with, you know, look at, but you can't see it in F5 very clearly. So walk there. See the redstone flicker. 
You really cannot see this wall very well. Walk again. See the redstone flickering. Walk here again. Look at the redstone flicker. And it finally dispenses an end rod. I don't know, chat. What do you think? Do you think it would have made sense to figure that out? You need to do it seven times exactly after checking. What are the numbers of the beginning chords? Um, I don't know. We'll figure it out at the end. It's probably a code for the end. You need like half a stack, yeah. What do the comparators do? Yeah, they, they just make it a clock. Okay. Well, we can move on now. I think it's safe to place the slab. Not that there. It's actually kind of crazy that that puzzle was actually at five, though. Hmm. Oh, that's blocked by the light. Okay. So, this next room. Bunch of barriers. Can we get L barrier in the chat? Worst block in the game. All my homies hate barriers. Nobody likes using barriers. They're very irritating. There's no way we can get an item frame. There's no way to get an item frame. So we can't really put anything on that pressure plate. And if we did put something on the pressure plate, it would just drop an item from there. You can make a clock with two repeaters, yes. But the idea is that the clock dies out. The The idea is that you, the clock die, like burns out, and then you have to do it again over and over. That's that what that's what the intended puzzle is. Okay. I'm worried that it's going to be another F5 thing. Also, just in case you're wondering, we can't do it again because this fills up and so this only powers once. So all these other end rods we're never going to get. Like, just period. I didn't check under the lava. Of course I didn't. Okay. It's light. There's the item frame we wanted. Yep. Yep. That's exactly what happens. That actually happened in my hopper map. One of the times when I was testing the map, the item frame moved too far to the side and it didn't power. That's actually a way you can soft lock. L soft lock times two. Soft lockable map. Impossible. You have to get lucky. There we go. What did it dispense? The dropper's empty. Oh, it dropped an uh, it dropped a boat. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Canadian, which escape rooms were your favorite? Terra Gaming's fun was m fun to make fun of. I haven't really done that many. Actually, yours is pretty good. Mainly because it was very easy to exploit and not confusing. I like that it was on the side of several ways to escape instead of these ones where, you know, you can just so easily soft lock with stuff like that. Um... Lava barrel out of 10. I don't know where to put this boat. I'll be honest. I'm not sure. Also, these... The barriers are just so confusing. Oh, do you think there's a corner we can glitch into? There's probably just some corner we can't see that we glitched into.
Yep, that was the solution. And now we're dying in snow. To be honest, I don't want to die in the snow. Hmm. How much snow is there? Okay. Found a way to the top of the snow. That's it? That's that whole... Oh, I bet there's something hidden in the snow room, isn't there? Oh, now we can go to the nether. We can also get through here eventually. Hang on. Just in the interest of time, I just wanted to speed run check if there's anything hidden here. Because we could check, but okay. Fishing rod. We'll do this whole puzzle legit. Well, and by legit, I mean like we'll actually try going through it. Instead of giving up like earlier. I was like about to give up. But. Let's see what's in the nether. Seems promising. Okay. Guys, we have the egg. The egg is back. The legendary egg is returned. We can't smelt anything. I don't know why this place is in the nether. They could have just built this room instead of making a nether portal. No. <laughs> no, what? Come on. Come on. If there's another furnace, I'm breaking it in creative mode. Okay. 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 Break. You can't... Okay, we have a fishing rod. Okay, we're breaking that one. Can you break that in survival? Yes. Okay. Breaking it then. I don't know what that observer is supposed to do, but okay. Okay, bro. We got the lever now. We can go through the trapdoor room. Watch this, guys. Watch this trick. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I got it. Actually, we should put the lever here. There we go. Okay. So now... We're doing alright. We're actually doing alright. I'm on a streak of solving puzzles. Isn't there a glitch where you can get into another room with another portal? If you stand on the edge of the portal? No. No, the whole, the way portal mechanics works is just, if the other portal generates, if the, it basically, whatever coordinates you're in, the exact coordinates you're in when you teleport dimensions is the coordinates it like checks. It, it literally, exactly the coordinates you're standing in, it multiplies by eight. The second test is, are you within a hundred, like, is there a portal within 128 blocks? So, one portal can't cover the range of 128 blocks. So, if they're perfectly linked, then you won't generate a new one. If the portals were far apart, which happens a lot of the time, then, like if this one was here, but then the equivalent in the nether was all the way over there, and then I crouched at the far end that way, then maybe my, my coordinates would come out to be here, and then... You know, it'd be far enough away. Actually, even that's not far enough away because this is still within 128. But I would assume that the the um, portals are right next to each other. Weefies did it. One video. Weefy, excuse me. Wait, can you link the video? 
Yes, it's just portal linking, but portal linking doesn't just always work. They have to be far enough apart. You can force it. What do you mean you can force it? Okay, so we're going to break these in creative mode. While I'm waiting for a stream delay to catch up. Yeah, this is definitely Weefies Weefy's inspired because that's how Weefies hides them. Bet there's a comparator here. Yep, typical. Is that enough? Nope. Okay. Bet there's something hidden here. Nugget. I don't want to check through all of these slots. If I can help it. Okay, there's also a barrel. Alright. There's just too much seeing things in F5 for this room. Hmm. You can perfectly link the portal. Yeah, exactly. If the per if the portals are perfectly linked, you can't do that glitch. What do you mean Canadian doesn't know? Do you know how many times I've exploited breaking into prisons using portal mechanics? I don't mean to be the... Do you know who I am, guy? But, like... If you're going to talk to anyone about portals, I invented using portals as an escape method back in the day. I hate this room. I don't want to play escape rooms anymore. <laughs> oh, no. We have to find all the nuggets. Do you have education edition? No. If you can link me the Weefies video, you can't put the link in chat, but if you can say the name of it and I can search it, like just put the title in and then a timestamp. Yeah, you can't put the link in chat, just put the title. They like the exact title, copy paste. I'm gonna drown. Bruh. Oh, do you think I'm supposed to make a chain? I might have been supposed to make a chain, but I don't know. Because I don't know where the exit to this room is yet. Can you beat Minecraft's hardest escape room? Question mark. Oh, it's in one of his old ones. Because I'm gonna actually talk to him if he's like wrong. But if. He's not wrong. Okay, let's check. So, is it his first one? Is it... Like, the one he made a year ago? His first... This... One of these. This this was his first one, I'm pretty sure. They're all titled the same thing. I didn't realize that that would be a problem. But he titles all of them the same. <laughs> Wait, can you beat Minecraft's hardest escape room? Can you beat Minecraft? Can you beat Minecraft escape? The hardest escape. No, they're they're different titles actually. They're different titles. So it's hardest escape room in Minecraft. Hardest escape room in Minecraft. This. Oh yeah, he's crouching in a portal right here. I I'm I'm pretty sure I already know what's gonna happen. So it's just, it's just right, this is just default portal linking. Okay, maybe I misconstrued what you were saying. I thought you were saying you could force another portal to generate by crouching at the edge. But I think what you're saying is you crouch at the edge to get to a closer one. So it's not that you can force a new portal to generate. What you're saying is just, if a portal already exists, you can crouch at the edge. And you'll end up in a new one. Yeah. Um, I guess you're right there. I think that's what you meant. I think I just misunderstood what you meant when you said that.
Because, yeah, it, it won't ever generate you a new portal, no matter how far away you're crouching. Unless the nether one generated far away. But okay. I guess that is a thing to account for. That it's possible that portals could be linked. And there could be another portal in the escape room. And I just have to anticipate it. Which is hard to predict though. That's another one of those puzzles that... Hmm. The fact that this is Weefy's inspired though means it's not impossible that they... Oh, no. I don't know where the exit is. That's not an exit. You can connect one portal in the nether to two separate overworld portals. Yeah. Yes. 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 No, I... I that, that whole conversation was just me misunderstanding uh, what they were claiming. But yes, I, I know how portal linking works. Okay. Problem is, I don't want to make a chain until I find the exit. There is no exit. Should we just go until we drown? No, I don't want to drown. I don't want to drown. Drowning is scary. Why is your voice so good? <laughs> uh, it's my noise. It's all because of the noise suppression I use. Default OBS noise suppression makes your voice sound good. Hey, we have a furnace. We already used that. Okay. It's so hard to see. I hate this maze. Why does this exist? Why? I don't see the exit. Use the trapdoor for air. Okay. Ren, respectfully, I'm going to place this trapdoor just to make you feel bad. There. You can sulk. You can sulk. Hope. Cry. Yeah, they waterlog, unfortunately. Seethe. Mm hmm. So what would we do with a chain? You could actually b breathe in a chain. If we brought the, tra the chain back out here... You know what I'm going to do, guys? I'm going to go and look at my replay file and figure out where the exit to the maze is. Yeah. Let's go. Optimal strategy. Best strategy. Um, Is this the exit? Wait, you have to mine a block? Oh, no, no, no. You have to be in this room. How do you get to that? That hole. Okay. From the entrance there, you take a right, then you go up, then you go to this corner, and then you're right in the exit. But do you need to collect everything while you're here? Because maybe there's more things to collect. I think that's all. Okay. I told you guys, it's the best strategy. You don't have to do mazes. Do you have Fulbright because it's dark? I do have Fulbright, but it's literally a it's literally water and like darkness. It, all the blocks are like black. So not much we can do about it. Chains oh chains water lock too, you're right, you're right. Yeah, sorry. I just I just Yeah, it's just dark concrete. Okay, well we know where the exit is now and I'll take the sign with me since I now know where the exit is. We can also go fishing, by the way, which can get us oh, quite a variety of items, uh, such as uh, tripwire hooks. I think you can get string, of course, saddles, lily pads, um, and enchanted books. I don't know how many of those would be useful. I've never used replay mod. Can you open chests? No, unfortunately, no, because uh, it doesn't render what the items inside please throw away all your items please listen to the sign above <laughs> no um there's barriers here there's also snow there this is a very weird room 
I'm so confused. Wait. Oh, wait, we actually have to. There's a hopper. Okay, but the thing is, the hopper doesn't know how many items we throw in, so let's just throw our most useless item. What's our most useless item? Oh, yeah, a single piece of steak. Oh, wait. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> well, um, well, no. Well, yeah. Then we throw in steak. Why though? Why? Just why? What do you mean just why? What do you mean just why? You told me to. Is that all the command block does? The command block just tells, asks you why you did that? Uh, I keep placing this wrong. I swear I'm aiming. I just want to, I just want to get my sign back. My sign. All right. What's your opinion on garlic bread? I don't know. This room is pain. I hope you like breaking snow. I dabble in breaking snow. You know what, guys? You know what I'm going to do in this room? I'm going to check my replay file. <laughs> Oh, so there's sand we have to get. What do we do with the sand? Oh, yeah, build up. But aren't there barriers in the way? Oh, you can't see barriers in replay. Okay, so the sand is at coordinates 2320. 2119. 2112. Okay. You guys remember that, right? Twenty three twenty. Twenty one nineteen. Twenty one twelve. Such a good exploit. Such a good exploit. Okay. Easy. And we move on. Oh, wait. I forgot this had barriers in front of it. Wait, I don't get it. Wait, what do we do? Oh, we never crafted chains. What would you do with chains, though? I I totally forgot we never even crafted the chains. And we could probably get the crafting table. Actually, we could most likely get the crafting table, too. Yeah. Okay. And go. Okay, we just have to be really fast. I think it's here. It's not here. Oh. Oh, it's not here. Alright, we gotta restart and get our, all our hunger back. Or uh, hunger. Breath. We gotta get the breath back. Fish for string and wool. Brilliant. Can you use the sign and moss carpet. Oh, is a good point. But also, I wanna get the chain. Obviously. And I will get the crafting table because I know it's possible. Ugh, I keep missing the hole. I have to get to the hole really fast is the thing. So what we'll do is we'll just instantly start mining it. And we will break it before we drown. Completely drown, I mean. And you might be wondering how I survive. Well, that's how. <laughs> yes. It's just close enough. And I'll craft the chain when I get back. Wait, where is his fishing rod? Oh, I just put it off time. That's all. Yo, Canadian, why are you overlooking me? Could have used the lava. Could have used the lave to break the snow. 
Uh. Yeah. Anyway. So, there's a little bit of escapist wisdom for the day. And let's craft that. Actually, I won't necessarily. I won't craft the chain quite yet. Let's do the carpet. Let's see how far we can get without making irreversible decisions. So, do you think we want to get up here? Where would we even get though? Because we obviously can't stand on the car on the snow. Where does this even go? That ledge up there? No way we can make it to that ledge. With all these items? Um... Maybe? Because one, two, three, four... Okay, so the coordinate of that block is negative 38. We're at negative 47. So, we need like 10 blocks to get up. We have the equivalent of two with a trap door, a crafting table, and then a chain. That makes four. We need like nine. Canadian, I know how to escape the prison. It's really easy. Just going creative. Game mode one doesn't work. Nether quartz slab. Come on. Brilliant idea. 500 IQ. I think I know the solution to the puzzle. Yes, yes. Yeah, what's that? Are, wait, are you serious? Are you serious? Are you seriously suggesting the quartz slab? Because I, I, was that a serious suggestion or was that a joke? I couldn't tell. <laughs> um, oh, no. You know what? I'm going back into replay. <laughs> I'm so confused. Where do you think we're supposed to go? So we get this sand. This clearly is the next room. Is here, right? But in this room, do you think there's any blocks we're missing that we never picked up? We couldn't elevate with the lava. Oh no, you weren't supposed to keep the lava, were you? Do you think you were supposed to glitch up the lava, like disconnect glitch to swim up it? Oh, I, I don't think that was it. That would have been absurd. Yeah, so none of these blocks. We could obviously also go fishing for string, but I don't think that's the solution either. I think that would be an unintended way. Dark frost. Really just control. Yeah, okay. Unless you can't catch leather in Java. Let me quickly check the fishing wiki. Oh, I right. Minecraft fishing wiki. I don't care about just regular fishing. Just going to double check the whole list. So the list is a lily pad bull fishing rod. Uh, Wait, I'm checking if this is Java. I might be wrong. Wait, am I in the Java one? Oh, no, yeah. No, wait, I think they're the same. Anyway, um, leather, leather boots. No way the solution is get leather boots. That'd be crazy, but you can actually get leather boots. Um, and it's 10%. There's a 1% chance of getting leather boots, though. 1% chance you get leather boots. You can also get string, of course. Leather boots wouldn't really help us that much because effectively that's only one more block higher to climb. Um, yeah, that's kind of it. That's kind of it. There's a water bottle, a bone, ink sack, tripwire hook just to finish the list, but none of them's useful. Doesn't have... 
We can get bamboo and jungle biomes. Yeah, well, they're not in a jungle biome. They can be caught in any size pool. Was there anything under the hopper in the lava? Yeah, no. We can double check since we're in replay. But I'm pretty sure there was not. Unless I missed something in a previous room. Which I do not believe I did. Wait a minute. I hope there isn't something in the walls of the dark room. I don't think there would be. This one's really confusing. Break the hopper, maybe? We already know there's nothing there. Break the terka. I'm in spec, guys. We're checking the replay. All this stuff's already broken. I can't tell if people are trolling or not. You could make bone meal. Yes, but I would need to get really lucky with bones. Like, I'd have to get good odds with picking up bones. Maybe you're supposed to craft a bucket. I don't have enough. Unless there's other hidden iron that I never got throughout the rest of the map. Then, um, look at that boy. I hope there isn't the iron I missed throughout the map. Uh. Hmm. Can you get... You can get so much from fishing? Yes, but the reason I'm not banking on fishing is because the rod is already partly broken and it's going to break pretty quickly and I don't think I'm going to bank on the 1% chance of getting three bones for just one extra block. Remember from the last room, luck-based solution is still a solution. Yeah, but we're trying to find the intended solution. Not assume that every time... Oh. Wait, no, that's the, f that's the later room. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, no. Okay, never mind. I th that's a later room. I think the solution might have actually been to just disconnect glitch up the lava. They wouldn't do that, would they? No. I'm so confused. You slash enchant luck of the sea to get your odds up. <laughs> Maybe there's a barrel in the water room. Sure. You probably need to keep the lava and use it to fire jump. Oh, fire jumping makes way more sense than disconnect glitch. <laughs> yeah. I have a bad habit of breaking lava. Last time, first room we did in the first escape room, the solution was to build a nether portal and I broke all that lava. Yeah, I, I guess you're right. That is a Weefies thing to do too. That's the kind of thing Weefies has done multiple times in his rooms. So it's probably, ah, oh, you're right. Of course, it's lava jumping. Let's put the lava back and see if it's enough. Oh, lava jumping is so hard in single player. <laughs> it is actually so much easier on a server. But, regardless, we will make it out of this escape room. And I promise you, this was not quick. I said we would do the other escape room if we finished this one quickly. We did not finish this one quickly. Okay, so obviously we have the signs, which are a clear indication that what they want from us is to do this. This is what they want you to build. And then put the craft... I don't think they expect you to get the crafting table, actually. But we got it anyway. Guys, it's so hard. Oh my gosh. I know there's water. Dude. <laughs> this <laughs> is way easier to do on servers. The recording is sharing more than someone on crack. 
What do you mean jittering? I'm so bad at this. Make a server then? You want me to just upload this to a server? Do you want to just hypothetically do the hypothetically lava jump and just skip them all? Or do you want to see me do it legit? Okay, I'll put it on a server real quick. I'm going to reutilize one of the new V2 server. So rest in peace to that world, that chaotic world. I'm going to upload. Well, I, I just want to do this legit. This is the last one we're doing this stream. So we might as well do it fully. I'll log out so I can upload it. Uh, what's its name? Void Vault? I think it's Void Vault. Surprisingly, I think it's actually the only prison that was built in the Void World. This is a five hour stream. Yo! Canadian, hello. Hope you are having a great time. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Great time. Ha ha ha. Imagine. Imagine having a great time. <sighs> Why is it on 1.19.3? Oh, wait. No, it's fine. We're fine. Okay. The server is starting. Make it a public server and then hit people up like a ladder. <laughs> <laughs> if I were to put a sandwich between two slices of bread, is it now a sandwich sandwich? Sure. It's one thirteen. <laughs> Yeah, that's the sound of our server. So this server actually has no whitelist right now. Anyone can join it. It's the same one I used last stream. Um, and now it's whitelisted. <laughs> okay. This will be quite a bit easier now. Let's pull out the lever and let's make a chain. Oh, it might be harder on paper now that I think about it. <laughs> no, it shouldn't be harder on paper. Normally you do it on paper. I like Eternos. Yeah. No, Eternos is good. Wait, it's 214 for someone? You must live in Canada or South America. Because East Coast in the United States doesn't go that far. East Coast is just 114. Remember when I said this was going to be easier? Maybe it was easier on an older version. I used to be able to do this so consistently. I did this on Wi-Fi server. Use lag to not get hit and then have all the hits suddenly register and fly. Yeah, and then get killed. How was someone in 3.16 a.m.? Isn't that like... Wait, I'm checking. No. No, because... 
Oh, never mind. 416 wouldn't make sense. 316 makes sense. The reason 416 doesn't make sense, if it was 416 a.m. for you right now, is because that time zone is only some random colony, some random overseas, like British overseas territory in the South uh, Atlantic. <laughs> and no one lives there. It's only scientists who live there. So I was going to say, so I, that's the time zone I thought you were in for a second. And I was wondering why. The islands are actually called the S South Georgia and the South Sandwich Islands. So I thought you were like sandwichy and um, scientists watching Minecraft live streams at 4.16 a.m. Which is a normal South Sandwichian thing to do. I'm going to bed, bye. It's already morning. In Europe? Oh my gosh, I have been streaming all night for Europeans. Log on someone from chat, then jump on a block and <laughs> Tired red stoner is too tired, he fell asleep. <gasps> there we go. We got it once. We got it once. I'm practicing. Okay. I'm dead. You know what? Let me... I'm just gonna do this. Just to save us time. There we go. I placed this too low. But yeah, now I remember. I got the rhythm, guys. I got the rhythm. I got the rhythm. I just had the rhythm wrong. Isn't Greenland UTC minus two? Is it? No. No, it's UTC minus one and UTC minus three. It literally doesn't hit minus two. At least according to this time zone map, which might be out of date. Which is funny because it's called time and date. Wait, I had the rhythm. Okay, I keep falling there for such a dumb reason. But yeah, I got it. I got it. Hmm. Okay, well, while we're here, let me place... Actually, do you think... Let me see how close we are to actually making it. Oh, you really do have to go all the way. We have to do the full nine yards. We have to go all out. Just this once. Yeah, we have to do every jump. Except one. We can save out on one. Um, I'm going to save out on this one. And then we'll do crafting table. And then I'll just have the trap door ready. Let's do this. Just cheat, bro. No, no. I'm going to keep you guys up till 5 a.m. I don't care whose time zone. Just 5 a.m. someone's time zone. Okay. Got to get more consistent. I'll get more consistent. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? 
Oh my gosh. Dude, right as I said, get more consistent. First try. <laughs> Let's go. We did it. We climbed the mountain. <laughs> oh, hopefully we don't need any of this blocks. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. So I think the dirt was the only item that was hidden in here. All of these item frames look empty except for that one that had the dirt in it. But clearly this isn't enough. Don't tell me I need to... No. No, don't tell me I needed to save one of the blocks. No, I can't get back. No. Guys. Is there a block we're missing? Is there some dumb trick? What do you gotta... I just... I was so happy. I was so happy a moment ago. I don't think that... This is it. Why did we have these nether quartz the whole time? Why did we have an egg? Fishing rod, the broken block. Check the barrel. Shut up! Okay, no. <laughs> You mean break this and then fishing rod it? It doesn't go up. Wait. Where is it? Oh yeah, it only goes to, it drags to the side. What do we do, chat? There's more stuff. The slab will save you. I don't have a slab. And none of this stuff is... It's all empty item frames. Oh, there's also pig step, apparently. Which gives me hope that maybe I missed something if the pig step was item frame looked empty. Maybe another item frame also looks empty when it's not. No, I think that it was every single item frame. I just want to... Do it in reverse, quartz slab. How are people still asking for the quartz slab? How are people actually still asking for the quartz slab? Abuse multiplayer to get up the end portal frames. Maybe there's a CPI. Three and three quartz deal. What do we do? What do we do? How do we escape? What was the point of the code? Remember this code? What was the point of it? <sighs> this doesn't do anything. Use the power of item frames. The code is in the coordinates of sand. So, theoretically, what I could have done 
is I could have placed this here. I had the chain here. I had the crafting table. No, I had the trapdoor here. Here. And then flipped up. And then I would have still had the crafting table. Do you think there's any world where I could have made this jump? Because this seems insane. Can you even fire jump that? Ah. I don't know. Yeah, people are going to bed. Get the fire and try the jump. Wait, actually, if I kept the fire. No, that wouldn't have made sense. That wouldn't have worked. How about this? I just want to try this. Oh, you could have done that. That's technically possible, guys. That's technically possible. I don't... We, we don't have to do it legit, but it is possible. You could have gone up all these jumps and kept the crafting table. I don't know if that's the solution, because I'll be honest, I don't... I didn't think getting the crafting table was even part of the intended solution. But... I don't know. I don't think you guys want to see me try doing that but all, but at least we figured out a way. It's technically possible if we did that a second time but preserved the crafting table. We make it to the end. Nice. Let's go. Alright. That was rough. That was miserable. It's been five and a half hours. But thanks for watching. Do you get the moss carpet in the water maze? Or is it from the barrel? I don't know. Watch us find out. There was just a block somewhere that I could have picked up. Oh yeah, I think I got it from this barrel. Wait, I could have... Couldn't you have just blocked off the lava? So you have a trap door in this room. It's how you get in here. You get in here using a trap door. In, the, in which case, you could have just placed it here. And... We could have... Guys, we could have gotten the barrel. <laughs> we could have gotten the barrel. <laughs> oh no, the solution was a barrel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. I'm never playing an escape room again. I hate this so much.
Well. <laughs> Thanks for watching. That was a waste of five hours of my life, and probably yours too, but you know what? It's all your fault, because you kept telling me to play another one, and now I'm going to bed, and you should too. Wait, we're at 1,999 views. Can someone just refresh the page so we can get that to 2,000? Then I'll close the stream. Barrels are minuscule. Item frames are eternal. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. This might make a good video, but... At this point, I'm like 50-50 on whether I'll even make this a video. Uh, for my main channel. I wanted this to be a main channel video, but I just don't know. I feel like there's not enough substance. But yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah, I'll go to bed. I'll shut up. And This is just so many escape rooms to skim through. Whatever. That's tomorrow me's problem. You guys get some good sleep. I'll not bother you tomorrow. You guys get a whole free day, at, probably at school, because you're all probably like 14 years old. And it's Monday tomorrow. So, yeah. <laughs> Have fun with that. Goodbye. I love you. I said I hated you earlier. Which I still kind of do, but I also love you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's it.